My name is Stephen Pope, and this is Legacy, a City of Mist game here on Saving Throw Show. I'll be your host for the evening, and tonight we have with us the always charming Megan Caves Callerman. Hello! Glad to have you here. Uh, Kelly Nuji, glad to have you back. Yay, I'm here. I've returned. I'm alive. From paradise. You go from paradise to Los Angeles. I don't yes. know what you were thinking. Uh, neither do I. <laughs> Alyssa Appleton. Okay. Always a pleasure. And you'll notice I'm just going to lean into this cube down here real quick. Uh, we have an empty chair tonight. That's because uh, Jordan Pridgen and Sydney are both out of town. Jordan's on the other side of the Atlantic. Sydney has been kicking ass at Fanime. We miss them dearly, but game goes on. Yep. So... Last week on Legacy, uh, while well, you were out of town, so this will be a fun little recap for you. Um, Alyssa, feel free to jump in because you're the only other person who was here that night. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> so last week, uh, Missy, Missy here, uh, got herself possessed by Legion by willingly putting on one of Legion's uh, many possessed pig heads. Uh, Alyssa was gonna try to uh, grin. It's sorry, catching. was gonna try to peel it off, just kind of take it off as much as you could. Yeah. But was convinced by uh, Doctor West to maybe just see where she goes with this. So they followed her to Poppy Sidon's Water Amusement Park. We got this, we got that, we got what you need. Um, only to find a small horde of legions and Poppy super fucking dead, like really dead. Meanwhile, Mandra was dealing with some stuff with Zeus, finding out Zeus is not his biological father, and Zeus, the head of all the Greek riffs, is pretty pissed off right now for many reasons. So, what am I forgetting? I feel like I'm forgetting something important. Um, I mean, he came and met us at Poppy Sidon's water park. True, with both Jesuses. Uh huh, with both Jesus. <laughs> yes. Uh, and we got into a fight with the Horde, and then Victoria burst in in her car and, and saved your ass saved our asses <laughs> yes um so starting from starting from that before we get into it you guys can play a role at home uh we are an entirely independent uh channel here we run exclusively off tips um so if we make you cry make you mad give you the feels Drop a dollar in that bucket. It really means a lot to us. It keeps the lights on. It keeps me off the streets. You know, we all we all know I need that. Um, and also, you can help unlock some cool stuff for the table. Some plot relevant. Some that I just thought were funny. You look terrified when I said that. I mean, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm going to find out. Mm -hmm. Now, usually we start off with a monologue from one of our players, but as there's been a bit of a shakeup with the table and everything, we're not going to do that. Instead, we're going to start off with Missy. Now, Missy, what does the inside of your brain look like? Mm, vision boards, bullet journals, uh, uh, calendars, um, uh, all connected by a series of Rube Goldberg devices. <laughs> um, Respect. Uh, which is powered by an exercise bike, which a little version of me is going on because you can't say no to the healing power of a little bit of cardio. So, so while you're cycling um, yeah. inside, you're powering all these devices, you have a sudden realization you're not alone. Well, it's not very sudden. You know exactly why you're not alone. As a small army of pig heads, pig headed people, though they look mo more like pigs just walking on their hind legs, come walking through your brain. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna turn down the speed on my bike. Okay. I'm gonna get off because safety first. Uh, hello? Hello? None of them respond. Though you do hear a little voice. Uh, from behind you go, I don't believe they can hear you. Okay. Uh, she whirls around to see if there's anything behind her. There's nothing behind you. Not again. No, no. I, Witch slap, thank you for the $5. Thank, thank you. you. Witch slap. No, no, I'm behind you still. I'm on your back. Uh, you reach behind you, you feel the hilt of your sword. So I'm going to... I'm going to... Hold it in my hand. DJ Regular, thank you for the $5. Hey, thank, thank you. you. DJ Regular. Love you guys. 
Um, and it's your sort of tears. Now, what does it look like again? Uh, it's um, so it's created from a mixture of salt mm -hmm. and glass, uh, and the salt is from the tears of people who I have ripped their happiness away because they didn't deserve it. Um, and it's uh, it's it's fairly beautiful, but not too ornate. But it, it does have like a kind of frosted glass appearance to it. Yes. Well, as you're holding your hand, you hear a voice kind of echoing off it. Hello, Missy. Lovely to see you. Hello? Uh, no, no, you don't need to hold me this close to your oh, face. Okay. I'm not a phone. I'm okay, a soul. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just a habit. <laughs> um, okay. Well, I feel like I needed to, to kill them? Um, I am usually on board with killing. I quite enjoy killing. It is <laughs> one of my top five favorite things, obviously. I am part of you. But, um, yes, do you recall why we're here? Um, okay, I remember putting something on my head, like a, like a ski hat? Was I going skiing? No. Oh. I was putting something, it was wet, it was, smelled bad, it, yes. it was, um, a uh, pig head. Yes, you are currently, well, your body is currently possessed by one of these, uh, well, let's just call them legionnaires. Really? Yes, really. Uh, I'm not surprised if you're in a little bit of shock. Okay, well, no, I mean, let's let's get to the, okay, let's unpossess me, let's go. I mean, time's wasting. Yes, I was afraid you were going to jump to that, and I'm not opposed to it. I am bloodthirsty at all times. Yes, I, I am also. am quite unhinged. Mm, I feel you. Yes. yes. I feel we might be evil. What? Evil? Just an idea, throwing that out there. What? Ah, I, no, De I'm about balance. <laughs> Whatever you need to say to keep yourself uh, asleep. Okay, let's put a pin in the evil thing and and we'll circle back. Ah, uh, pins, pointy things. I approve. Uh, yes. Yes. Um, here's the thing, and I'm saying this as part of your subconscious. Mm. I'm not actually real. You are possibly losing your grip on reality right now. Mm. I am going to say this, though. Um, if they're able to come in here, that means you can go out there. Okay. I'm following. So maybe, okay, like what's a little bit of lies and unfairness in the great pursuit of fairness? Exactly. Okay, great. More I'm... importantly, if we find out how to, where this one is coming from, we can bathe his blood. I quite enjoy that. Oh, <laughs> I don't like messes, but I, I like that. Okay. Um, all right. Well, let's, uh, let's, so I, what, like, pretend to be one of these pig people? No, I don't think they're quite intelligent. They're pigs, after all. Okay. I guess... Which way should we go? Should we follow the Hall of Pauls, or should we head down uh, where the pigs are coming from? I'm quite fond of the Hall of Pauls myself. Hall of Pauls? Paul! Paul! Okay, well, Paul. Yes. I can't there. say no to Paul. We gotta go to the House of Pauls. Hall of Pauls. Hall of Hall of, Hall of Pauls. <laughs> I didn't know you were gonna have problem saying that, but that's gonna be a thing from now on. <laughs> okay, we'll go to Shape Hall and we'll figure this out. Sounds quite lovely. Let's go. Okay. As you head down uh, your subconscious little uh, mind palace mm -hmm. towards the room where you keep all the pictures and memories of Paul, including oh. the weird ones. Oh, Paul. I miss you. I'm gonna find him. I'm gonna find him. He's not, he's oh, not. I'm quite aware. He's not gone, he's just missing. Exactly. Okay, and he wants to be found. He does, more okay. than anything. Okay, you know, I, I love you. All right. Loving yourself is important. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay, so this is all great, but how is this helping us find Paul being in this space? Oh, I have no idea. We're I know just here? 
Yes, I know just about as much as you. I am part of Great. your brain, after all. Okay, so this was fun. But, you know, a little for me, a little for the world. Let's let's go to where the pigs were going. As you head off deeper into this hive mind of pigs, um, we cut to Victoria's car. Now, Victoria is this spindly, white-haired woman who doesn't look like she's bathed or slept in a couple days. And she's joined by this young girl, black hair and ringlets, uh, gothic Lolita fashion, like she stepped out of something from 2003. And they pull up to a very ornate yacht. What is this? Oh, this is where, Victoria turns to you, uh, clears her throat. This is where Sincere works from, usually. Our bodyguard is there. I think you will like them very much. Um, as the black-haired girl and Victoria exit the car, um, now Dusty, what do you look like? Um, I hadn't really thought about it much aside from how I dressed, I suppose. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I think of her as being very big and rugged, um, and, uh, kind of messy. I mean, I'm going for a little bit of the, like, Nordic look as well, so probably. But but the type of person that's more focused on the work that they're doing and less focused on how they currently look. Mm -hmm. So, you know, does have a big scar on her face, um, and she's probably just... A badass scar, I dare say. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, yeah, and she's just kind of... I, I think she's probably blonde, uh, and she just has, like, all this hair, and it's just everywhere. Just everywhere. I kind of want to roll the dad scale for you, but I feel like that might be a little over the line, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> roll the what? The daddy scale. Something I've done since uh, Uncanny Valley. Oh. Yes. Okay. Um, oh. So, this is your boat. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Uh, what's it called? Skyfold. Skyfold. Mm -hmm. Uh... The younger black-haired woman waves up at you with a gloved hand. Dusty! Oh! Hi! You made it! Yes. Thank you. Uh, can you uh, lower the bridge? Thing? Oh! Uh, yeah! Right on it. Thank Start you. It. Uh, the black-haired girl turns to you and she gives a very warm smile. Uh, I'm Shelly. Bryn like... Kirsten. Thank, Thank you, you Kirsten. Oh, Kirsten. Good name, too. Bryn tries her hand at a smile, but it looks more like a grimace, as it tends to, and shakes her hand. Hmm. I love your work, by the way. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> so as Gangplank lowers, uh, Victoria, you know, gives you a little, you know, bow. Victoria, how are you today? Well, we have a pig problem. A, a pig problem? Yes. Big, is that common? Is that common for you? Not often. Yeah, I wouldn't expect a pig problem in the city much. No, no. It's giving me a bit of a migraine. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. Uh, is my absent aboard? Oh, uh, yeah, we've got it. You know, you know where to find it. Great. It's in the usual spot. Shelley, will you uh, entertain our guest? <laughs> I'm going to go take some lithium and absinthe and just see where the night takes me. Shelly just kind of gives a thumbs up as uh, Victoria shuffles aboard. Great. <laughs> oh, Bren, such a talker. <laughs> such a talker. Have you come on board? Am I supposed to, like, yeah, am I? Oh, uh, Shelly turns to you and smiles. You can come on board. Uh, I think Coach and uh, Harry are here too. Okay. The young young woman in the dress kind of holds a hand out to you. Uh, you can come on board. It's uh, kind of mine too. So. Okay. Yes. Bryn says, and she and she starts to walk. Hey, uh, nice to meet you. What's your name? Ooh. My name's Dusty. Uh, Bryn. Oh, great to meet you. I'm just gonna pat you on the back really oh. hard. Great to meet you. Come on board. You're welcome. Th Make oh, yourself thank you. at home. Take whatever you need. There's drinks. You just follow where you know. 
Well, I mean, it, uh, we can show you, of course, if you're looking for something. I, I, I like your hammer. Oh, thank you. I do like my hammer as well. It's much more powerful than it looks, but it's a, it's a lovely little tool. It's got all kinds of little bits in it that I can do stuff with, so I always I like keep it on me. Much. It's very helpful. Mm -hmm. And it hits things real hard. Oh, thank you. Always finger cutters. The words. <laughs> So, uh, <clears throat> Shelly, clears the throat. Uh, yeah, so we should probably head towards uh, the meeting room. I think, uh, I think it, we need to have a little talk. A meeting? Yeah. Anywhere? Yeah. If you're okay with that. Lead the way. Meetings are great! Love meetings! Oh. Jeez. Chipper? The bar. Thank you, the bar! The bar. Thank you for the bits. Um... You go into the yacht. It's quite beautiful, hardwood. Um, you also kind of notice it's sort of a mishmash of aesthetics on the inside. A little bit of Edwardian influence, some uh, pre-Victorian shit, some 1920s stuff. It's a bit of a eyesore, but it kind of works. I mean, Bryn like lives in a mountain. So. You're, literally, you're literally a cave. Woman. Literally in a cave. Yes. Uh, I, you go deeper into the yacht, and you're brought to a small wooden table. Uh, Victoria's there. She has a green glass in front of her, and she looks like she is feeling great. Um, next to her sits kind of an older man, uh, paunchy, bald, missing an eye, and he just looks like the most sour motherfucker on the planet. And next to him sits a... Bearded, very handsome man. You put in about 35 or so. Okay. Yeah. Oh. And apparently we unlocked the first uh, tier. So thank you, chat. Thank you, guys. Uh, oh, uh, have a seat. Have a seat, will you? Yes. The younger man says, oh, okay. uh, Dusty, you can join us. Oh, you I are will. under our employment after all. Yes, I am. Thank you. Ah, uh, so, uh, Bryn, right? That's me. Yes, I, we haven't met. I knew, uh, Carl, your mentor. I was quite familiar with him. Uh, my name's Harry. He talks about you. Ah, good things, I hope. Yeah. Were they good? Some of them were good. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, uh, we're sincere. All, all four of us. Uh, are you? All, dusty are you all of sincere? No, no, no. The four of us are part of sincere. You, we are. You're okay. Yes, they are, oh. and they like to say things sincerely. Oh. Yes, it's a good joke. I like making that one. They love it. You can tell. See, look at that. They love it. Coach <laughs> actually goes. Hey. See? Coach <laughs> got it. I see why this works. Yes, mm -hmm. works great. Yes. Um. We have been, obviously we've been doing this for a while, all four of us, um, even Shelly here has been doing it for about three decades. This girl doesn't look a day over 20. But How old are you? That's we're weird, but... possibly ageless. Oh, are you always in these bodies? Um. Well, Coach tried to shoot his eye out a couple years back, but it didn't seem to take, so... Seems so, yes. You want to see the wound, kid? Kind of. He flips up his thing, and it it's a nasty scab. Ooh, we could have probably cleaned that better, but it's all right. What? You squeamish? Oh, no, I'm not, but I think other people are. Didn't think you were. <laughs> no, I love a good scar. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I like this one. Where's the drunk one? They didn't come on the boat. That, and he launches into a string of obscenities I'm not going to repeat because we get uploaded onto YouTube later. <laughs> Brynn sort of grins at that. And yes. It's like, ah, that I little, like you. Ugh, fucking bitch. All right, all right. Sorry for the sexism. Sorry for the sexism. I'm a bigger man than that. So. Let's see where we're at. Yes. So we're sincere. 
We kind of keep the wheels turning. I've assessed that much. Yes. Uh, what we liked about all of you guys, uh, you and your, uh, you know, fucked up friends, what we liked about you guys was you kind of broke your stories. We appreciate that here. We broke our stories? Yeah. You married the wrong guy. I mean, marrying anyone was the wrong choice. No arguments. I've been single for most of my life. It's a good call. But you married the wrong guy. You broke your story. And then you became a hermit who sells weapons. Okay. Uh... Your friend... Your friend... The murder you stabby one, not the hot one, the one that wears the polyester. She, I'm turning into Brooklyn over here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she, not supposed to get married, not supposed to join the PTA, not supposed to be a wino, but she did. Right, but, I mean, destiny or whatever, I mean, it's, that's kind of a crock of shit. You know, it's like you live the way you live and you have what you have and then that's it. Victoria kind of sloshes over to you and she throws an arm around you. Darling, destiny is what we are supposed to succumb to. Do you understand? It's what we do. It's what riffs and avatars do. We have our stories. We are Thor. We are Scotty. We are Sylvia Plath. I'm supposed to put my head in an oven eventually, but I won't, because I changed my story, and I discovered beta blockers, and they are wonderful. I don't know what that means. I don't either. I bought them off someone on the corner. It feels fantastic right now. Oh, Everything mixed, is kidding. It's with all... Okay. Yeah. Good, good choice. Shelly kind of comes over, grabs her by the shoulders, and leads her back to a chair. Sorry about her. She's a little... No, she's... Wonderful. And they weren't beta blockers. <laughs> uh, obviously not. <laughs> yeah, no, no, we tried we tried to get her on beta blockers, but that's not the story. Um Isn't we... it isn't it better then if she's supposed to put her face in an oven and she hasn't put her face in an oven and I got away from the person that I shouldn't have married? I mean No, it is a good thing. Okay. That's why we sought you out. That's why we sought out Dusty. That's why we seek riffs like you. You broke your story. So you collect us? We don't collect, we employ, we try to help. Some of us more than others. Um, Harry? Harry uh, reaches into a, a drawer, pulls out a piece of paper, gives me something to write. No, just say something. I gotta pick. Oh, up. oh, oh. <laughs> so, like, I don't have shit. Uh, Bryn? I can't read much, so okay. I Okay. He, you see him scritch something down. He folds it up into kind of an origami envelope. Claps his hands. Check your pocket. And you pull I so out. wish I had something in here. So <laughs> I like, do, too. <laughs> and it's the envelope. That's how we communicate. And she opens it up and looks at it. And it's, and a like, doodle, it's like a stick figure you. Oh, I was like, oh, she was going to be like, that's what my name looks like. <laughs> <laughs> he did write Bryn on top of it, but. Oh. So you snap your fingers and we get letters. We try to direct. Yes. Sometimes ghost yes, hack 159. Thank you, ghost hack. Thank you, ghost hack. And, you know, it's usually good. Sometimes we fuck up. Okay, I fucked up, I'll be honest. My name's Harry, I'm a fuck up, how y'all doing? But, uh, yeah, so we... We kind of need you to, uh, break your story further. Like it how? Well... Uh... And now that I know that you want me to break it, she's like, doesn't know anything about, about any of this. Doesn't it then become 
part of the story? Well... So breaking it? It becomes part of Bren's story. Not Scotty's. Oh. Yeah, it's like very like... <laughs> Gatsuk oh, Media! What the hell is that? Thank you for resubbing. <laughs> yeah, it's like she's it's like she's like looking at the universe for the first time. It's like oh. Shelly looks at you, Dusty, and kinda of giggles. I love that look. <laughs> yeah, it's a good one. Okay. Yeah. So, um we got someone kind of following their story to a T. Yeah. Okay. But they're not just, it's not just their story anymore. It's kind of Missy's. No, it's all, it's all of yours. It's Dusty's story now too, but, um, do you know the name Veritas? I've heard it in passing in the, in the market in town, but. Yeah. They've gone a little too into their story. Okay. We cut back to the collective unconscious that Missy is wandering through. Now, how does this look like to Missy? Mm, okay, so uh, this is where all the pigs are coming from? Yeah, and as you follow the them, there's thousands of pigs just marching. Okay, so it's just... Oh, Counter Roleplay, thank you for the host. Oh, oh hello. Wow. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. So there's just, like, it's endless halls of pig heads. And it's, when she walks in, it's like, it seems like it's one large hall that seems to splinter off into other smaller halls. Mm -hmm. But then when she turns and looks at each hall, it's actually a huge hall. That's just as large as the main one. It just appears oh to be God, small when you're not looking at it. Mm. So as she keeps turning and looking at each hall, and then as she, then she turns around and she realizes she's completely surrounded, and she's like at the center of like uh, an asterisk shape of hallways of pig people, just completely full. And the ones that aren't moving, so there are a few that are like, well, every once in a while, like, start and then walk away. The ones that aren't are just standing completely still and it's almost as if they're just like, like waiting, but they're still. Sounds horrifying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, as you keep wandering through these endless hallways, um, you find a door marked exit. Huh. Oh, an exit, I'll just go through here. And as you do, you find yourself a couple thousand feet above the city. Like, I'm on a balcony overlooking it, or I'm no, just... No, like, you're kind of floating. I'm floating. Like... Whoa! Okay. And <laughs> you have a key in your hand. Oh. Do I still have my sword in my other hand? Yes, you do. Uh, huh? Oh, uh, yes, yes. I forgot the voice I gave him already. <laughs> Welcome to hell. <clears throat> it was like British. A little, a little I think. little British. I can't do voices, why do I bother? Mm. Oh, uh. oh dear. I believe we're in the collective unconscious now. I think we escaped that brain, but we're still not in our body, so we're just kind of everywhere. Okay. All right, well, um, I, well, we should, Try and, I mean, how do I get down there? Think really hard. Uh, huh? And you are standing in what looks like a flat version of the city. Like it's 2D? Yeah. Uh, am I 2D? No. Okay. <laughs> That'd be horrifying. That'd be horrifying. Cubism. <laughs> Um, flat Missy. Flat, <laughs> flat Missy. Missy. Um, around you, you see little kind of stick figure people. Okay. With doors where their heads would be. All right. Ugh. Okay, well, I just got to open up the right mind and pop right in. Yes, but which one? I mean, I could just start opening. 
That might be a bad thing. What if I get lost? Okay, well. And at that point, you see a small piglet come running by your feet. Oh. It's actually 3D as well. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, hello? An uh, adult is speaking. Missy, I don't believe it can speak. It can't? It's a pig, I don't know. I don't really know how things work. I am a figment of your imagination. Okay, I wanna try and grab that pig. Okay, um, <laughs> roll to go toe to toe. Oh, actually, hold on, I need. Mean, you need dice. I need dice. I mean, you can use my yeah, options, really quick, thanks. Ooh. Um, okay, so I'm gonna roll to change the game. <laughs> uh, I think I'm just gonna roll straight because I don't think I have anything that will help me capture a little pig. pig. <laughs> Okay. Uh, is it a teacup pig? It's a teacup pig. Aww. Yeah. Does it have spots? Of course. Aw. Okay. Uh, and I rolled two dice? Is that how 2d6. It? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Brenda's going to be super jealous of teacup pig. That's a six. Uh, so ten. Okay. Um, ten. And you capture this pig. <gasps> and it is kind of... It starts squealing, and the squeals slowly turn into the cries of a baby. Ooh. Does it look any different? No. <laughs> Is it stopping? Um, Shh. it's not, but you hear what sounds like a fight behind you. What? Um, you are no longer in the 2D city. You are standing in what looks like a really grimy basement. Do I still have the pig? Yes. Okay. Does she also have the key and the sword in yes. her hands? <laughs> so I'm like, okay. Well, the, it's, the sword could probably float. It is imaginary after all. Okay. Uh, you can just... Oh, yes. I'll just, just do that. Okay. I'll just float behind you. Okay, great. Um, hey, who's fighting? There's no response. And you hear uh, plates crashing and everything. Destroying plates? I'm gonna run and try and figure out. I'm gonna run to the source of the sound. <laughs> you run up the stairs. With the pig. You run up the stairs and you're greeted with a kitchen and it looks like it's. Oh, it hasn't been updated since the 70s. Everything's that Pepto Bismol. Yeah. You know, like an olive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, and you see this woman, nightgown, rollers in her hair, and she is yelling at a guy in a wife beater and boxer shorts. And there's a kid hiding underneath the kitchen table. Um, I'm, I'm gonna squat down to the kid and, uh, psst, hey, hey kid. Does he respond? It, the kid t turns around to look at you. And there, this they kind of have an upturned nose. They're not a, you wouldn't call it a cute. They're not exactly cute by any means. Okay. They got, they're blonde with a bowl cut. And he just kind of stares at you wide-eyed. Um, I want to, like, hold the little pig I have, like, next to the little kid and, like, compare their faces. The pig is objectively cuter. Mm-hmm. Obviously. <laughs> okay. Um, obviously. Obviously. <laughs> really. Uh Okay, um, uh, now, okay, I'm gonna try and insert myself in between the, the man and the woman that are fighting. Uh, they don't respond. Do they don't even seem to see me? No. But the kid comes out from underneath the kitchen table and he's kind of staring at you as you go into the living room and get between these two. Yeah. Sounds like a scene from The Sixth Sense. It does. It feels like it. <laughs> Why are you helping us? I don't know. I just, I, I, I heard a fight and, and I guess I just don't like pointless violence. I think it should have a point. Do you want to know the truth? Yeah. I don't think there's ever a point. Oh God. Okay, so you're, you're, you're like nihilistic child. The kid starts growing up, pimples start appearing on his face, <laughs> he gets that awkward unibrow every uh, unfortunately hairy kid gets in their teens. <laughs> um, 
And soon a not very attractive priest is staring at you. Uh, hello? We know there's never any point to anything. Okay. Um, yeah. How about you roll to investigate? <laughs> uh, okay. Um, I'm going to use um, tracking, snooping around, and incredibly observant. All right. Uh, six, seventy-nine. Uh, all right. So... So, you can either give me a straight answer or a solid lead, but also you can choose one of the following. Uh, your investigation exposes you to danger. The clues you get are fuzzy, incomplete, or part true, part false. And whoever or whatever you're asking the questions can ask you one question as well. You answer on the same terms. Uh, since I rolled with a power of three, then I get three questions? Yes. Okay. Um, are you Legion? This was before we were Legion, but yes. Okay. Um. Don't you want more than this? Well, yes, I, I have things I personally want, people I personally want to find. Do you really want that truth, though? I want it if it won't hurt me. And he kind of smiles at that. And you have two more questions. Oh man, okay. Uh, where should I go to learn more? What do you want? I want to know what you want. If you say truth, I'm gonna scream. He walks past the fighting people right as uh, the woman has picked up a very heavy vase and smashed it into this guy's head. And he opens up the front door. And you're in a church. Kind of a rundown one. Mm -hmm. Not the nicest one. Definitely not near uh, Rolling Hills. Okay, right. It's not Rolling Hills uh, Presbyterian. No. Okay. Or Temple Overshown located yeah. in Rolling Hills. Right, okay. I hope Missy teaches Sunday school. Oh no, she does, she does a vacation Bible school in the summer. <laughs> mm. That oh. is the most horrifying <laughs> thing <laughs> we have ever done. I am going to have nightmares <laughs> about that idea. I need like a one shot that's just her. Like, <laughs> Next week's my birthday Bible special. Girl. We might just do that. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Um, and there, there's the priest standing next to you and you see another version of him. And he's talking to this woman and she... Doesn't look very special. There's no other way to put it. She's not ugly. She's not beautiful. She's just... You would lose her in a crowd. Mm. And as she's talking to him, you see his face drain of color. And you see him kind of sit down on his uh, pulpit. And you see him cover his mouth. And you see as she presents him with a pig head. She showed me the truth. Okay. So do I have one question left? Or I have no questions left? Um, I can't remember. I'll let you have one for free. Okay, thank you. Um, who is she? Oh. Veritas. Veritas. Um, I... She's the reason I am what I am. His face starts to kind of stretch a little bit as he starts approaching you. Good! She taught me what's real. She taught me about the mist. Do you know what the mist is? It's a thing that makes people not see who we are, the normies. No, it doesn't. 
do that. It blocks us. It denies them what they need to know. It denies us what we need to know. And his voice is starting to get kind of echoey, like there's seven of him talking at once. Okay, you're really freaking me out. I want to try and stab him in the mouth. <laughs> Hell fucking yeah. Um, With the pig. With the <laughs> <laughs> <A> little pig. <laughs> Yeah. Eat this. <laughs> uh, no, um, I'll do it with my sword of tears. Yeah. All right, go ahead Not and hit with all you've got. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna hit him with all I got, uh, and I'm gonna use I uh, cut you down, uh, and wrathful. I don't think I have anything else. Catman to the rescue! Hey. Thank, Thank you for the bits. Also love the name. Oh. Whoops. Okay, so that is. 11 plus 2, 13. <laughs> okay, um, you get to give him a status of, let's see, you rolled with, you got 11, you rolled with 2, correct? Yeah. So, you can give him a status 30. Okay, great. Um, and Megan, since you're new to the system, I'll go ahead and explain. You don't have hit points in this system, but if you take a status of 5, you're out of the game. Cool. Okay. And if you take status six, you're dead. Okay. Or good as well. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Um, ghost hack. Oh, ghost ghost hack. Thank you. Um, I'm going to. Okay, I'm going to give him the status uh, throat stabbed. Very on point. I like it. <laughs> Okay. And then um, I get to choose two of these, um, uh, of, of these ones. You, you take cover, secure a superior position. If you don't choose this, they can impose a status on you. If they're a PC, it's tier their power. You get them good or get many of them. You control the collateral damage. You hold the target's attention. You gain the upper hand, take one juice. I am going to uh, take cover. Okay. Uh, and I'm gonna get them good. So I'm gonna add one to that tier. Okay, so you gave him a tier four. Okay. Um, you stab him, and blood just start, starts spurting out like a fucking Evil Dead movie. Nice. And uh, where did you duck for cover? Uh, behind, I like jump back behind one of the pews. And is this a Catholic church? Um, sure. Okay. I'm Jewish. I don't know the difference. Okay, I ask because I want to know if it has the things where people uh, confess. Hmm. Sure. Which is those like little boxes that have like a thing over it. You can't see it. So I jump over that and then I crawl and like hide inside of one of those confessional booths. Uh, okay. Um, you hide in there as... I can still see. They're like kind of see-through. So yeah. See. Um, you see that he's bleeding from the throat, but he's still coming after you. God. Ew. Ew. Do you care to confess your sins? <laughs> Uh, the separator slides. I have seen the actresses. I do. <laughs> separator slides, and you're greeted with a very handsome blonde man. Hi, I'm Christian. Are you Missy? Oh yeah, <coughs> yeah. It's you. Hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Jesus. You want to get out of here? Yeah, let's go. Okay. <laughs> um, you're gonna have to leave though. You have the key. Oh, this thing. Yeah. I saw the pig with me. And this. I'm assuming you mean the actual, this isn't a metaphor thing, it's this thing? Yeah, that's a me that pig's a this metaphor. This is a little pig? Yeah, it's a <laughs> metaphor pig. It looks, it's very cute. It is so cute, I'm gonna bring it with me. I don't know, Bryn might like it. Yeah. She puts her <laughs> 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 put it in my purse. You put it in your purse like it's a little dog it's and you're in Beverly Hills. It's a duty purse, <laughs> put it in there. Okay. Okay, uh, all right, just stay close behind me. Uh, I want the sword back in my hand. It's it's in your hand. Great. I'm gonna try and just uh... okay. I want to run out and I want to uh, uh, see if there's a collection plate anywhere near. Okay. Uh, you're gonna have to roll to change the game to find that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to. Can I use a uh, incredibly observant? Yes. Okay. Great. Uh, 10, 11. Okay. Uh, that gives you two juice. You can spin it out how you want. Okay. Um, 
So I want to... Uh... Oh, and one more thing for Megan, because first time playing. Uh, juice is how you guys can add stuff to the game that might not always be there. For example, since you are Thor, you can add thunderstorms. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Um, I want to, uh, as we're running out, I want to grab the collection plate and throw it like a frisbee and aim it for uh, the priest's like bloody throat so that I can um, add plus two Right, I can do two t one tier per point of juice. So can I use the two juice um, that I have on one? Oh, or it's one to one. Maybe yeah, I can't do that. One. Okay, so I want to add one tier of throat stab. <laughs> okay. And then, um, I don't know what, oh, 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 and I can also, okay. Um, I guess, well, I don't know what else to use it for. Well, you do it to add something, remove something, take something away he wants. No, oh, okay. it doesn't sound like you're trying to change the game so much as you're trying to uh, hit with all you got again or go toe to toe. Oh, I see. Okay, then in fact, let me then let me change it so that it can be changed the game. All right. More change the game-ish. Um, I will, uh, can I, okay, I, I want to throw the, the, um, Collection plate. collection plate like a frisbee and have it bounce off of the walls to create like um, a cacophony of sound that he gets super distracted by. Okay. Hopefully. Um, okay. So that will be a story tag called. Yeah. Story cacophony? tag of uh, yeah collection cacophony. Collection cacophony. Ooh. I like it. Alliteration rules. And me and Christian are running. All right. As you two start running, I'll add collection cacophony, you can tag that. Um, you start, you find yourself back in that 2D version of the city. Um, okay. This time it's now flat below you. It's almost like you're standing on top of a map. Okay, I'm not really smart. I don't, I, 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 uh, I gotta be honest. The smart guy sent me here to help you. I don't really know how to get out of here per se. Uh, we just gotta find a door. My door, exactly. Okay, um, all right, you, um, and that's for this key? That key will work on any door. Any door, okay, great. All right, so we need to find your door. Um, you are like Jesus-y. Uh, I'm American Jesus. Okay, okay, Yeah. American Jesus. And that's when you start hearing uh, the sounds of Christian rock music. Is it Creed? It's Creed. Okay. With arms wide open. And I'm like, we gotta go there. Yeah, that's probably mine. Okay. I love Creed. You and only you. All right. <laughs> so, are you a member of Creed? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, I want to go towards the Creed music. Okay. Um, you start running towards the music. Uh, I'm going to need to roll to uh, face danger. Uh. Okay. As you start seeing these pigs kind of start popping up from the world around you. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I have... All right, I'm going to roll it flat. Six. That's a six. Okay. That's a six. All right. <laughs> um, and you are grabbed by one of these two-dimensional pigs popping up. Ugh. Giving you the status to grabbed. Oh no. So does this mean that the next time I do something, it's negative, negative two. two? Okay. Yes. Unle Unless well, you I'm can change ungrabbed. the game to correct it. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so I want to try and change the game. Well, or... as you're grabbed and you're, you felt you are, you fall over onto this two-dimensional plane and ripples come out and you just realize, oh God, you're sinking. And as you realize that, we cut back oh to, uh, <laughs> we cut back to Skyfold. And in front of the two of you, uh, Bren and Dusty, uh, Sincere, all four of them, have put out a series of pictures of 
dead riffs. Pinocchio was the first one. Red Cap. We thought it was Red Cap. That's why we initially sent you mm -hmm. to hunt them down until we found out it was actually this pig-headed fuck. Um, many pig-headed fucks. Many pig-headed pig fucks. Thank you. Start with Pinocchio. Uh, old lady who lived in the shoe. Went to Dracula. And recently it's Recently, they've gone after exclusively gods. We don't know exactly who. We thought it might have been the Aesir. Nothing personal, Dusty. It's okay. But until we found uh, that Hela was dead. Um, but mm. recently, it's been, you know, with Poseidon, we just don't know. Anything? We don't um, know anything. Except pigs. We know pigs, and we know Veritas. She's just kind of gone off the deep end. She wants to destroy the mist. Okay. Uh, does she have to do with the rock people in the forest? That one we're not sure of. We're pretty sure, though. Do we have to kill her to kill them? Is she them? She's not Legion. But she's got Legion on her side. We don't know who else she has on her side. And that's pretty much everything we know. Do we know how to kill her? How do you kill the truth? I don't know. I don't know. Stab it a lot. I like that. It's a good plan. I like it too. Yeah, I like it. I'm on board. Mm-hmm. Who's up for stabbing? I vote stab. I'm always up for that. Mm-hmm. Uh, the other three kind of look at the three of you and go, uh, I don't know if that will work. I'm not... Well, we might as well try it, right? No harm. Does this have to do with the Sword of Lazarus? That's mostly her thing. Uh, Hi, is it kind of Victoria is just gone. Mm. She is gone. Gone. And the bees? What about the bees? Oh, that's a gift from her. Oh. I like the bees, too. She almost falls out of her chair. Shelly grabs her and just oh, puts her back up. Oh, good catch. Thanks. Is this typical? When things get a little stressful for her, she tends to go to this lovely little place of uh, inebriation. That's a yes. Yes. Did she ever say anything useful when she's there? Did she see anything useful when she's there? Don't think so. So yeah, that's kind of what we need from you, Bryn. We need you to find Veritas, and we need you to put her down. I mean, happily, she sounds like she sucks. She does suck. She sucks so hard. She's the worst. But we, do you know what she looks like? Ugh. <sighs> Harry reaches to his jacket pocket, pulls out a picture, and he slides it over to you. Can I take this? Yeah. Um, I'll go ahead and doodle it for you, because I can actually do this. <laughs> there she is. It literally kind of looks like a stick figure. One of a kind. <laughs> but that's an actual photograph, not my artistic rendering. Yeah. She's in the city, or we don't know. She's definitely in the city. Okay. She can't leave. She can't leave? No. Why? She's Is not an abbot. Huh? Is it the mist? Is it's that why she wants to get rid of the mist? We don't know why she wants to get rid of the mist. Okay. I thought maybe it was keeping her here. No. She just can't seem to leave. We don't know why. <sighs> okay. Well... If I kill her, she'll leave. Maybe. But she would be dead if you killed her. Right, so she would leave. That would be a form of leaving. That is a form of leaving. It just it depends on how practical you're trying or to be. Or maybe she'd be trapped here forever. Uh, that, we don't want that. No. I mean, she'd probably just go nowhere. Isn't that what happens when we die? Well. 
I mean, you can go to Valhalla. I, mean, I like that Canada. place. It's very nice there. Canada? I think that's different than Valhalla. I could be wrong. I don't. Is Canada don't Valhalla? Harry looks like you've kind of destroyed his worldview with that <laughs> line. I've never been to Canada. Me neither. I haven't really left the mountains in a long time. You should go. There are lots of really neat places to see. Like Valhalla. Oh, I, I like my forge. Mm -hmm. It's comforting. I'm very good with it. Now, real quick, out of game. Do you two know each other at all? You are Thor and you are Scotty, after all. Have your paths crossed ever? How does that, how does that work? I mean, we're all here in the city, right? Yes. So you mean, like, in these particular forms? Mm hmm I mean, if you stay in your mountain most of the time, maybe not. Yeah. I come down, I come down to sell weapons, like, on the market. Mm-hmm. Um... So we may have crossed, you know, a couple of times. I have a proclivity for interesting weapons. Mm. Um, so I probably haven't seen your hammer before is probably why she's interested in it. Mm. Um, but we may have crossed paths once or twice, but I do not think. Uh... Do riffs automatically recognize others? You do recognize. Do you know who it riffs. is? Okay. No, not okay. all. So it's not like we'd be like, oh, uh, we're hey. from the same mythology. <laughs> 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 Also, Gothic like Media has given their reroll to Megan. Oh, thank yes. you very much. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we don't really know where to start with this one, but we do have a tag on your friend Missy. Okay. Yeah. Uh, currently, her body is. Uh, well, used to be the red, used to be the white room, but then a bomb went off, and now it's uh, they're calling it the gray room because they're nothing if not cute. Yeah, the bombs. Yeah. Good build, by the way. Yeah, thanks. I You're mean, welcome. They're good bombs. They just not when they're used by them. Agreed. Anyway. So this gray room. Yeah. We tracked where Missy is. Her body's at the gray room. Okay. Where she is, TBD. What does that mean? To be determined. We don't... No, I, I don't know what TBD means. I'm oh, asking okay. What I, you're, that means. We know you're kind of a cave woman, yes. so... I prefer... No, that's fair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um... We don't know what exactly happens to... R We've never had a rift possessed by another rift before. Well, I mean, it's Missy, if anyone's gonna be hanging on. It yeah. would be her. I'm sure she's fine. I'm fine. I don't know which... I'm sure she's fine. I'm sure okay. she's fine. There's nothing... What could possibly go wrong in there? It's a pig head. Do you exactly. know how to get the pig head off? Um, well, we've ran, we've done a few tests. Uh, do not pull it off. No, that, that removes the head. Yeah. Like, I, yes, we've, yeah. clean cut. We have, yeah. Um, peeling sometimes works, as gross as that is. Shelly tried that one. She had a, way too much fun with it. I did. Have you tried electrocuting it? Um, we did. Yeah. Mostly just kind of fries the person okay. and makes bacon. I mean, that makes sense. I thought about freezing it and trying to break it off, but that... That might shatter the head, too. Yeah. Um, if you can find a way to just kind of make... We think if you can get Legion to leave the head, then you can just remove it. But we're not positive on that one. So far, peeling. That's your best option. Peel to the pig. Un so to get Legion to unpossess... The pig, is that what you mean? Yes. Yeah. the pig head. Uh-huh. I have to find Legion. Right. Oh, I guess Legion is there if the pig head's there. 
Kind of, sort of. It's kind of like uh, her with her hammer. Okay. Um, I guess... I Dusty, guess I... you mind going with her? Oh, of course! I guess we go to the gray room. Alright. Uh, do, you, do you need a lift? I know your minivan is... Uh, you don't know how to drive. Oh, uh, no. I walk. I'll take a lift, but I typically walk. Okay. Uh, Harry reaches over, kind of shuffles through Victoria's purse. Uh, okay, yeah. Um, he hands you uh, this, it looks like a key ring. Mm. Just show that to the driver, tell him where you're going. He'll, he'll give it to you. Perfect. Right? Cool. Okay. So, um, by the way, Bryn, thank you. Happy to get rid of shit. That's what I do. And it's appreciated. Thanks. Now, you are Missy. Mm. So, you're grappled by pigmen yeah. and you're sinking into this 2D plane of uh, the Cliff of Unconscious. Okay. Uh, what do you do? Um, I want to see if Okay, if I put my sword flat on the 2D, does it start sinking too? Um, it doesn't sink too. Okay, I want to pull my sword out, put it flat, and like hang on to it. Like you should do if you ever encounter quicksand in real life. Seriously? Yeah, if there's like a, if you put something flat down on it, like a, like a stick or a plank, it won't sink because the surface area is large. That's very good to know, thank mm -hmm. you. I also spent most of my childhood thinking I was going to deal with quicksand much more than mm -hmm. I, I do. I think we, most of us did. Yeah, because yeah. you thought yeah. it would be everywhere. I, I really thought, like, you leave the suburbs or, like, any civilized place and it's, like, right. quicksand. I mean, I also fully thought that Jumanji was, like, totally going to happen to me yeah. whenever I played any board game. I was hoping it would. <laughs> Is that the same thing? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> okay, so I'm hanging on to my sword. Right. Is this stopping my sinking at all? It actually is. Okay. Though the pigs are trying their damnedest. Okay. That is just not going to work for me. Um, I am going to... <laughs> what, what's happening with, uh, with Christian right now? Uh, Christian is... He's still bolting towards this giant neon door that... Uh, it's Blasting Creed? It's Blasting Creed. Okay, great. So he's fine. Okay, um, I am going to, um, I guess, what do we think would be, well? Okay, uh, I'm going to, I guess, go toe-to-toe -to -toe with, how many of them are on me? There's like five. Oh my god. Okay. I'm gonna go toe to toe with them, um, where I'm just gonna try and uh, like kick the face of the one that's like lowest on me. Okay. Uh, and I do not think I have anything that will help me do that. No, nothing kicking specific. Uh, cool, I'm just gonna roll. Uh, nine. Nice. Nice. So, um, on a seven to nine, I get to choose one. Uh, I managed to achieve my goal. Uh, I get them good, giving them a status. I block, dodge, or counter. Um, so my goal was to kick one of them away from me. So yes. I do that. I think that's a smart goal. Great. So you kick them away and, uh... Okay, you got one of them away. What are you going to do? You can pull yourself up. You can try to just use your sword and stab him. Um, I'm going to... Okay, I'm going to... You have a very evil look on your face right now, and I'm here for it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to, uh, uh, like, stop using the sword as leverage, grab the hilt of it, and I'm just going to... And this is, I think, maybe it's kind of stupid because I'm swinging towards myself. I'm going to try and slice off 
the little arms that are holding on to me. <laughs> this sounds very risky, so yeah. take the risk. Okay. Um, One of my favorite moves in this game. Okay, I'm going to do it with Cut You Down and Wrath Form. I'll say that's fair. Okay, great. Oh my god! Wow. <laughs> Do you want one of my rolls? Can I give her one of my rolls? <laughs> I'll allow it. But I kind of want to lean into this. Your choice. Um, <laughs> Miss, okay, Kelly, would you like the re-roll? I would like the re-roll. <laughs> oh, damn it. Uh, I'll take the re-roll over um, the GM's cackling. Uh, <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> I'm so scared about what you were going to do to me. Okay. Let's try this again same, with same things. There you go. Okay, so a nine ten. Ah, uh, <laughs> so disappointed. I am. You have you ever played Legend of Zelda? Yes. Okay, you know when you charge up your sword and do the whole yeah yeah spin around. Yeah. You Nothing. pull a link. <laughs> okay. You pull a link, and these hand, pig hand, human yeah. hands, this horrible island of Dr. Monroe bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They go flying off. Okay. And you just kind of bounce out of this two-dimensional plane back to where you were. Okay. I'm running towards that neon door. Okay. You make it towards the neon door, and it is the entrance to every mega church you've ever seen. Oh, God. Uh, I'm going to go in. I'm gonna use my key. <laughs> um, okay. I'm gonna need you to face danger. Oh no, okay. As you enter this door using the key. Okay. Uh, Missy bursts into place. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna use, can I use incredibly observant? Um, no. Does that work? No, okay. Ooh, what about incorruptible? That would work. Okay, great. So I'm gonna use that. Cause that's the thing that works. Okay. Um, what, what, what am I looking at? So it's a five and I got five. six. Ooh. So no, I didn't, <laughs> I did not succeed. Oh, no. Okay, so I have good news and I have bad news. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the good news is you're back in your body. Okay. Bad news is, you're definitely sharing the ride. Oh no. So you are consciously back in your body. Okay. But you hear a voice coming out of your mouth. Ooh. That's not yours. Oh God. And you can't, you can kind of see out of this mask, yeah. but Barely. It's mostly kind of like having your head inside a hot dog. It just feels yeah. ew, ugh. Ew. And you can hear the muffled screams of someone. Okay. Am I like laying there or am I doing something? Um, you seem to be doing something, but no. what it is exactly, you're gonna have to roll to investigate. All right, I'm gonna You're roll. You're basically in. trapped in your own body right now. Okay, I'm gonna roll to investigate to see what I'm doing. Okay. I'm gonna use uh, tracking, snooping around, and incredibly observant. If those work. Okay. Yeah, ten. Okay. Or, um, so, yeah, ten. All right, on a ten. Uh, so you rolled with uh, two juice. Three. Three. So you have uh, four questions. Okay. Um, why do I have four? You get plus one when you roll over ten. Oh. Okay. Uh, no, you do not. Sorry about that. You so get I get three. Okay. Yes. Um, okay. What am I doing? Um, you're able to tell after a while. Um, your body is tying up someone. Who is the person? Uh, she is an African American woman, very fashionable, very pretty. Um, and her eyes are pure silver. Do I recognize her? Um, you kind of do. Okay. You recall um, a little while ago when you were, when you had your first fight with Legion, 
Before then, you and Lorelai were going to go to the Grey Room and you were going to talk to someone who knew something about Paul. Yeah. Um, you can't recall their name because my notes are a mess. Uh, right. You know her name is Bay. Okay. This is her. Okay. All right. So yes. those are my three questions. Yeah. Okay. So, Bryn and Dusty, as the two of you pull up to this, uh, it looks like it was once a really nice nightclub, but it's kind of been, well, bombed out, literally. Um, you see that someone has painstakingly put the debris together in a way to make it kind of look intentional on the outside. Like, someone made a nightclub and the theme was bombed out. Like the most tasteless nightclub on the planet. Oh, holy hell. They aren't doing a very good job of hiding this, if that's what they're trying to do at all. No. Well, I say we just push our way through and go yep. right in. Yep, me too. Okay. I like you. <laughs> I like you too. I think this is going to work great. There's no bouncer or anything. It's about... Uh, Let's see, the fight will lead in time from, it's like four in the morning. It should be closed down. You push your way, the door is locked. Not a problem for either of you. You both kind of have super strength and you have an army of squirrels here. <laughs> Best. So, um, you enter this dark nightclub. They've got, it looks really nice on the inside. Like someone's fixed it, but it's empty. The lights aren't on, the music's not going, uh, the bars, the lights behind the bar are closed. What do you two do? Well, so we're here looking for... Missy. Missy. You know her body okay. is here. All right, so is there a particular place your friend might choose to be possessed in? I don't know, I don't know how, how to... Uh, I mean, they called you in. You've got to be real smart if you're the one they called in to do this, so... Uh, I wouldn't put it that way. Hmm. Um, I mean... This isn't really normally the kind of place she would be. I would... I mean, Mander might be here, but she... I feel like Brit is, like, kind of trying to fumble around to, like, find yeah. lights. Okay, yeah. maybe there's a light switch somewhere. Yeah. I'll probably put a few holes in the wall in the process. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Uh, maybe you should do that. Um, eventually, you guys do find some lights, so you get some dim lighting. Okay. And how about uh, both of you give me an investigate roll? Okay, so I roll two die. Yes, you roll two d6, and you can use any of the traits on your list. That thank, you, thank, you, thank you, Nightseed. Thank you, Nightseed. Nightseed, thank you. Uh, I can use any of my traits, and the... If I use one, I get a plus one. Yes. If I use two, okay. That's if you use I two, have. it's plus two, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. Uh, this is straight. I, don't, I like, don't have anything. All right. Yeah, and I'm using the power tags, right? Yes. Yeah, I don't know that I have anything that would be good here either. Um, except, wait, what are we, so we're investigating? Oh, yes. Yeah. Um, if I, can I, can I use authoritative and be like, Missy, if you're in here, tell us. Right now, say, say where you are. How about how about you give me a convince roll instead? Okay. And you can use other tags. Uh, convince. Yeah. So what is it? Oh, up here. Convince is another type of move you can do. Here I see. So you can use authoritative and anything else on anything else you have that might work here. I feel like potentially I could use six scar for that. You know, I'll love that. if they can see me, it might be scary. Uh, okay. Uh, we'll call those two. Uh. Eight, nine, ten. Uh, okay, sorry. Not at you. <laughs> oh, ten. No, no, no. no, no, no. We I too it. rolled a ten. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> you rolled with power zero, so you get one. So I get, yeah, ten. I get one. Yes. Um, I get one question. Uh... Is is this the only level of this building, or are there levels above us? There are levels above and below. Great. That answers my question. Um, and when you 
you know, give a nice big booming Missy. I don't know why I'm giving you that voice. <laughs> they don't sound like that in any way. Yeah, that's close. Cool. <laughs> so sorry. Um. Okay, I'm gonna need you to roll go toe to toe real quick. Okay. <laughs> Am I going to toe to toe with Thor's voice? No, 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 no. You are going to go toe to toe with the thing in your head. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay. You're basically fighting to gain control real quick. Great, 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 great. Uh, I'm going to use uh, incorruptible. Nice. And that's it. Okay. In this mental health awareness month, <laughs> we are going toe to toe with the voices in our heads. <laughs> it's an important thing to do. It really is. Six. Mm hmm. Seven. So, seven? Yeah. Okay. Didn't um, fail. Didn't, fail. didn't so, fail. You did not fail. That's so a, our motto. The goal was. Didn't fail. The goal was to take over your body. Okay. To gain control of your body again. Um. But you don't have to choose that one. You can choose one of the three. Uh, uh, you manage to achieve your goal. You can get them right. good. Give. Okay. Um, well, I want to achieve my goal, which is to, to, to get control of my body. You have control of your body right now, but you can feel that you're going to be fighting it for a minute. Okay. And you hear a booming voice call your name. I'm going to start sprinting towards that voice. Okay. Um, Question, what, is the pig gone? The little piggy? Uh, no, or it's definitely in your purse. Yay, it's in my, I brought it with me. It's okay. We're going by Nightmare on Elm Street logic here. <laughs> it comes with you. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I'm just gonna go sprinting towards the voice. Okay. Can we hear her where she's running? Um, you do hear, uh, you're wearing heels, aren't you? Oh, yeah. You hear sensible the clip-clop of sensible heels. No, you know what? They're espadrilles. Can we say they're they're like not espadrilles? They're espadrilles. Not espadrilles. <laughs> oh, the horror. <laughs> this is not wedges. Um, <laughs> okay, I'm running. I'm running. I, sounds like it might be working. And yeah, like you come. Hmm. You were in the back of the club where they, you know, store the liquor bottles and the lost coats and everything. You come running out towards the dance floor where these two are. And you two see a pig-headed Missy come running towards you. Is that, is that, is that? That's her. Oh, okay, good. Missy, I'm what sorry. are you? About to kill it. You have to use you your voice. You have to remove my head. Yeah, but I can't just pull it off. It'll kill you. Peel it. Or right, is there anyone else here with you? We are all here, says Missy. Oh, um, oh, okay. okay, so don't electrocute it. We got that. We're not gonna fry you like bacon. <laughs> I learned that one uh, earlier. So I guess we peel, right? You have. I mean, my. I can try to give us a. Uh. I take off my, my uh, the arrowhead that I or the spearhead that I wear around my neck and it and. It I'm grows like, full size in your hands. <laughs> <laughs> my weapon grows full size in my hand. Um, I'm real mature. <laughs> um, I'm an adult. And. I look at Missy and I go, I mean, you know it'll cut anything. I'm gonna try to stay still. I think, I mean, I'm obviously this thing's gonna be fighting you to stay still, right? Oh, yes. So I'm not staying still. <laughs> I'm like thrashing around on the ground. She's not very good at that. No. <laughs> <laughs> try. Just, just, just try. Okay. Okay. I'll try to hold her still while you cut it. <laughs> All right, and I just have a real quick announcement uh, about the unlock. So thank you, chat. We have reached tier two. Woo! Uh, I thought I'd updated it. Uh, apparently, it did not save. I apologize. However, I will respect what it says. Uh, now, which one of you is more? Out of the three of you, which one of you is more spiritually inclined? <laughs> oh. uh, do you mean spiritual or religious? Uh, your character, but oh, either character. or. Not in real life. Uh, I don't. I don't ask this sort of stuff at the table. Um, no, but no, I, I get what you're saying. Like, like are we like, talking? Like, are we talking? Our logos about, or mythos, right? Yeah. Well, well, I mean, spiritual in terms of like, I feel like Bryn is probably very spiritually connected to like the forest and her animals, but she's not religious at all. So, like, right. are we talking religion or are we talking? We're talking yeah. ghost. Oh, okay. Um, Missy is fake religious, where she, like, goes to church, but she doesn't believe any of it. Okay. 
uh, I, uh, Dusty's definitely not religious. Um, I, I don't, I think that Dusty's very much like, I'm just one of the world, not so much, uh, spiritual in that sense. Got it. If that makes okay. sense. Okay, um, as you're thrashing about, name someone that you lost at sea. Someone that I lost at sea. Um, I, lo I lost my first mate at one point. Um, his name was uh, Jared. So Jared. <laughs> Jared. 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 The best one I ever had. Not Jerome. <laughs> Trusted him with my life. Not Jerome. Not Jerome. I got your back, baby. He died saving my life. Well, as he died saving your life, as you are fighting against Missy, um, you are joined by a translucent being who has come down from Valhalla. Jared. Uh, okay. So Can like, we see just, him? Or yes. Just, okay. <laughs> Holy shit, Jared! How? I, I've come to help ya. I don't, why am I gonna, why did I do that? Well, he was a pirate before he joined me. <laughs> yeah. So I was gonna say, it's, you've committed. I've committed. It's I committed to the bit. <laughs> yes, and! <laughs> What? How? How is this? How is this possible? You've come down. I've come down from Valhalla to help you fight this. I am your spiritual companion because they have unlocked here to a g -g -g ghost. Oh. Well, what thank the fuck? you. Well, I, I, I never got the chance to tell you. Thank you for saving my life. I, I would, I, I would have done anything to switch our places. I wouldn't. I know. That's I was an old man. You are a young sea lass. It was worth it. Also, I had that horrible, horrible addiction to online pornography. I was going to go out one way or another. I'm glad I went out via the sea. Yeah, that that is good. I do think you that see this entire conversation. I, by yeah. the way. That uh, that wasn't going to last much longer for you anyway. <laughs> no. so. Both me and the spirit are just, or both me and the legion thing are like. You're <laughs> oh, both equally appalled by this, but this is quite touching. But. Might we? Yes. Yes. How would so it, is it now, if you use Jared, mm -hmm. so Jared is what I'm going to consider Jared a story tag. I will probably be moving this over to Lorelai later because this was originally written for her. But let's just move along. So here's how it's going to work. Jared okay. is a story tag. You can use Jared as if he was one of your power tags, and he can help you. Okay. So you use him for a plus one on a roll. Okay. And okay. he does not go away. Cool. Yes. All right. Uh, how is it that you can help in this situation? Well, I am a poltergeist, so I can help with moral support, and I might be able to help physically. Huh. I can probably help hold her down at the base. Oh, oh, yes! Let's do that then. That okay, seems so important. Uh, you two are going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe against each other. Okay. And this is going to be my legion side is doing this. Yes. Okay, great. Um, can this Legion side use her tags? It will definitely use any physical tags you have. Okay. Well, Wrathful. Oh, yeah. <laughs> In its mind, Incorruptible. Does that apply? I'll allow it. Yeah. Okay. So two. Okay. Um, could I use, I'm a survivor. So, and could, I mean, in this instance, I'm essentially working for the sincere, right? I'm doing this mm -hmm. job, so loyal to the end. That's a good one. Okay. Uh, I mean, mm, probably, well, oh yeah, uh, well, I can use Jared, right? That'll be a three. Can I also use my loyal crew? No, it says the Valkyrie, so that'd be something more specific than that, right? Well, you could give your loyal crew a call, they'd come down and help you, but... Okay, I think I've got three. I'm a survivor loyal to the end and Jared. I'll go with that. All right. And Jared. And, and Jared! Okay, you two are going to roll off. Uh oh. Uh, plus, I did two. So, eleven. Uh, 11. I got a 10. <laughs> oh no. Maybe I can reroll. I can reroll. Uh, that's the wrong one. Uh, be better! Oh, I think it might be. Yeah, be worse. Eight. 9, 10, 11. Now I have 11. Okay. Oh, we tied. You tied? Um, yeah. <laughs> Six. So, Nine, as you both 10, got over... 11, 12. No, I got 12. No, she had 12. You got 12. 12. I did. Okay. Uh, with that, you win, and you could choose two from the go toe-to-toe -to -toe list. Okay. Um... Well, I'm trying to hold her still, right? Yes. 
So I feel like I need to achieve my goal. That's fair. Um, and, uh... I think blocking, dodging, just making sure this yeah. Legion-possessed body doesn't yeah. go after you. I yeah. think that's the best one. Jeez. Trying to keep her from kicking me. Yes. You know, trying. <laughs> so, Bryn, what are you going to do? Um, I'm gonna try to slice and peel this, uh this pig head off. Okay. Um, I am going to remove my hammer from my uh, from my apron because I'm going to use I'm going to use it along with a spear to cut and <laughs> peel. Oh, that's so be gross. Very disgusting. All right. Um, is this is this take the risk? Because this, this is, is definitely take the okay, risk. Okay, because I was going to say this is fucking stupid. Also, um, I'm not sure if this is applicable, but I will allow it. If you would like to use the forge from the crew thing Ooh. as well, I will oh, allow yeah. that because okay. that is your specialty, and this would you are using the tools from the forge. Yeah, um, yeah. I was gonna use. I was gonna. I can use the forge. I was gonna use cut any material, grows to full size, um, <laughs> hammer and chisel. Oh, uh, I don't know if marksmanship works because that Probably sounds not. more like from farther away. Um, but that's so you're rolling four. the four. Wow. Uh, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm, yes. It is the grossest. Oh, I bet it's foul. You've ever felt in yeah. your life. But you see, uh, you managed to do it. Just go ahead and describe it for us. Oh, it's like, and. She goes, Bryn goes, like, straight for the center. So she, like, sort of, wi like, with the hammer, just, like, just enough, puts it in so she can, like, feel the flesh and starts pulling it and puts the hammer in and crack. You, and she could just hear it ah. cracking, and it's, like, cartilage and cracking, and she's just, like, digging through flesh, and, like, it smells <laughs> like it's rotting, and it's... Oh, God. You know, I like bacon, but this is making me rethink it. <laughs> I love animals. I, <laughs> like this. I might go vegan for a couple of days now. I'm just throwing that out there. Um, just like, and Missy's like... <gasps> yeah. you, you come out, your hair's a mess, your makeup is uh, smeared. Oh, terrible. Your makeup is terrible. You're a mess. Yeah, okay, great. But you are no longer possessed. Yeah! No longer possessed. Uh, did I get well... Welcome back. You look a lot better than you did before. Oh, thank you. I'm Dusty. Um, Dusty. Hi, really. hi, Missy. Little Leaf. <gasps> Bryn! I hug Bryn. Oh. Oh. Oh! And I like rest my like pig goo face <laughs> oh, on no. the side of Bryn's face. Oh. oh no, no, no. I'm no. so. Oh, God. It was. I got something for you. And I reach into my bag and I give her the little baby pig. Yeah. And it's like. <laughs> the only like time that she really grins, it like lights up her face, and she's just like, "We're gonna make, we're gonna make this little guy a story tag for you." <laughs> <laughs> Here's a story tag, Piggy. Piggy, Piggy, Piggy. He's so cute. Hi, buddy. And she like puts him in her apron, like next to her, like next to the <laughs> hammer and the chisel. Just, oh, his like, little right arms in. are out. Yeah. Yes, it is Instagram worthy, you'd say. Mm. And then you hear the sound of many feet running towards you, and you still hear some. You hear the screaming you heard earlier. Uh huh. All three of you can hear it. That so you're not alone. Sound good? Oh, okay. I did an oopsie. I tied someone up back there. It wasn't me, it was Legion. I, I feel like if we like untie this person. Yeah. Maybe we can yeah, get them back on our side. Right, I want to run back and... Wait, miss it, maybe. Okay. Okay, as you just make a <laughs> fucking break for it, uh, you're greeted with about uh, six pigmen. Oh. I know. Okay. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I, I think that means follow. Does that mean follow? Yeah, that means. Yeah. All right. Three of you run after them. There's six pigmen. Yes. What do you do? Oh, well, we, we can kill these ones, right? These aren't your friends. Kill them. Okay. I don't know them. <laughs> <laughs> Great. 
<laughs> I love the logic. <laughs> uh, okay, so to attack something is go toe to toe or um, other things. Okay, so yeah, attacking say, someone could be combat? hit with all you've got or go toe to toe. Um, you can also be, take the risk if you're doing something incredibly dumb and risky and awesome. <sighs> um, so, combat does not have an initiative order. So, you can have the spot. Any one of you can have the spotlight to begin. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, really what I want to do is literally try to call down some thunder on these guys. Some lightning. Okay. That's actually going to be change the game. So, okay. go ahead and change the game for us. Okay, so... We do love weather. Mm. In our group. Yes. yes. <laughs> um, I'll allow you to assist if you'd like. Cool. So, I feel like there are lots of things I can roll for this. And you can roll all of them. Huzzah! You don't use the grit system. Oh. That's the hard mode. <laughs> so, okay. So, I can use thunderstorms, bigger boom, ride the lightning, create a storm. Yeah, that sounds fair. Okay. Okay. So, that's four. Yeah, so I like to imagine she's standing there and it kind of starts to, to grow darker and her eyes start to light up blue and there's this electric feel everywhere. And then we'll oh, see like if this that actually... Five and... <laughs> so six, then seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so yes. you have four juice. Okay. Yeah, um, so juice allows you to just add whatever you'd like to the game. Uh, status <laughs> is here. Okay. <laughs> Um, I thought you were doing that because of the bug. No, I was trying to get this to blink. I think it you gotta does. hit. Don't you have to hit the. Ah! Oh, you almost had it. Almost had it. <laughs> anyway, um, okay. So, I'm doing change the game. And you okay. said, I'm sorry, tell me again. You said I can do. So, you have four juice. So, you four. can add uh, a story tag. You can uh, burn a power tag or story tag. You don't need to worry about that because you don't have one of those. Okay. Um, you can give or reduce a status. So. Um, if I were to give, like, burnt status to these <laughs> pigs, or, or, like, electrified, maybe. Yeah, that, that would that? work. Okay. That would work. You do, can I do that? So if I have four, would I be essentially able to do that to four of them, or would it be all of them for one? Well, since you rolled over a ten, you get to use the entire list, and that includes scale okay. up the effect, prolong the effect, hide the effect like this one likes to do. Mm. Or With any ice. other improvement that you and the MC agree on. Mm. Okay. I mean, you know, we were just talking about bacon. Yes, yeah, so would you like to give all three, would you like to give all six of them uh, the tier three status bacon? Uh -huh. I'd oh, sure, that. sure. Let, yeah, let's do it um, like burnt or electrified or uh, shocked. <laughs> Always a favorite at this table. It is. Shocked. And then we're like, like shot or shocked? Electrically shocked. Electrically shocked. shocked. Not like <gasps> shocked. I mean, right. they can be both. So they, are. they are all shocked. Now you guys can use this set for your advantage. Huzzah! Okay. I like that very much. Sweet. Lightning comes down, and it's a fucking anime where it hits them, and you see the bone outline for a second. <laughs> That's my favorite part. Yeah. Everybody looks funny that way. Yes. <laughs> now, which one? Of, who else would like the spotlight? Okay, I'm going to hit with all I've got. Okay. Um, I'm going to uh, uh, jump up and on my landing, just stab downward with my Sword of Tears onto the nearest pigman. Okay. How um, are they all standing? Just, um, just kind of clumped a little bit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to use... Um, cut you down, wrathful. That's it. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and invoke your weakness tag of bloodlust. Oh, yeah. Wait, no, you don't have that one. No, I you don't. You have bloodthirsty. Bloodthirsty. I'm going to invoke bloodthirsty for you. Uh oh. Okay. Yes. So then I'll only be having one. Yes, but you get to mark attention on that thing because that works a little too well for this right now. Yeah. Besides, so attention the on sort of head. tears. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Eleven. Nice. Okay. Um, you bring the sword down. <sighs> and you were going with hit with all you got or toe to toe. Hit with all you got. Okay. Uh, you have 
You have one power. What are you going to do with it? Um, I'm no, gonna... wait. You get to choose two. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, because I got ten. I got eleven. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I am going to uh, get him good. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to uh, counter their best attempts. All right. Um, as you're coming down, it tries to just stab you in the throat, but mm -hmm. it misses. Mm. And you stab it directly through this pig's skull into this guy's skull. And he just kind of slumps down to his knees, and you have one less pig to worry about. Great. Shing. Oh, good one. <laughs> Thank you. How many are there? Left? Thank you. There's there five left. There's five left. There were six altogether. Um. Realistically, if they are standing close enough to each other and I positioned myself correctly, could I stab two of them at once? If you roll well enough, I'll allow you to do the spinning attack she did earlier and stab all of them. Oh, yeah. I will use... But... Yeah. <laughs> I want that as my ringtone. <laughs> um... I will use cut uh, cut any material. Okay. Grows to full size. Um, can I use marksmanship for this one? I'll allow it. Okay. That's what I can do. I am going to, however, invoke your weakness of indoors. Okay. Oh, I have another weakness tag, by the way. Do you do you have that written down for me yet? Oh, because I added gained one. a new one. Yeah, I gained a new one because I gained another power tag. Oh, okay. Uh, which is arrogance. Arrogance. Mm. All right. Thank you for letting me know. Which is in my adaptation. Nice. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, so Megan, uh, mm. weakness tags, you can use them, and you get a negative one on the roll, but you get to gain attention on that theme, and that's like an experience point. Mm -hmm. You okay. get three. You get something new for that theme. Okay. All right, so I'm rolling with two. Ooh, oh, snake eyes. Is... Oh, oh, wow, wow. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, that would have been so fun. Uh, six, eight. Eight. Okay. Um, that's an eight on hit with all you got, so you get to choose one. I will... Um... I will get them, get them good, or get many, I will get many of them. Okay. So you manage to slice around and you do, uh, what power were you rolling with? Uh, two. Okay. So you have uh, stabbed most of the shocked piggies. Okay. <laughs> However, uh, they're going to give you the... The status of return as they all get their attention on you okay. and several of them stab and you gain two bleeding. Oof. I do want to point out that I cover my piggy. Good, good, good. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> he's just like, what? <laughs> Listen, there's a couple things in this game that are always going to survive any incident forever. The minivan, the squirrels, <laughs> Pig. <laughs> Yay! The rest of you guys, I don't give a fuck about, but those things are gonna live. <laughs> so, who would like to spotlight? So, how many are left? There are five left still. There are five left. Mm -hmm. Um. So, I like to think of this hammer that I have as looking like this. It's compact, but actually, if I wanted to use it, it's sort of like uh, magically grows. Uh, <laughs> nice. Yeah, growing weapons. Yep. Yeah. So, uh, growing so, weapons. so I want to, I want to Filthy. see if I can essentially, I mean, depending upon how they're standing, I want to try to hit sort of like what she did and see if I can knock them in the head and just kind of knock them into one another. Cool. We're going to make that a take the risk. Okay. I like it. Um, Am I going to have to roll to dodge this? Because I'm like, <laughs> I'm, I'm in the fray. We'll see how she rolls. Okay. Come on. Oh, um, no. Okay, so... Because I had to... My spear is a spear. I didn't throw it. I, uh, I feel like I could use hammer down. Hammer down. Um, maybe bigger boom. Oh, love it. Okay. Um, yeah. Heart of a lion? No, that's more... No, no, three. I'll love heart of a lion. You will? Okay, so yeah. three. Three! 
so seven, eight, Ooh. nine, ten. Woof! Nice. Okay. I made it. I did. Um, <laughs> oh. <laughs> so you have landed on your knees, yep. very dramatically. Hero pose, <laughs> the whole thing, and you get stabbed, and it hurts. Yep. And you're protecting the pig, and then <laughs> you come in swinging. <laughs> And uh, what power were you rolling with? What power? Yeah, like how many tags were you using? Three. One, two, three. Okay, they are barely standing. Okay. Uh, as I do, I'm like, good duck timing! <laughs> <laughs> um, right. so, I, so I'm assuming that they're squished together now in yes. a line. <laughs> okay, I want to come on the other side and just stab and hopefully get more than one of these pigs on okay. on my sword, as shish, a, like a shish kebab. You're shish kebab being bacon at this point. Yes. Okay. You guys are ruining cream barbecue for me. <laughs> uh, okay, hit with all you've got. Yep, and I'm gonna use cut you down and wrathful. All right. Ooh. Uh, Ooh. 10, 11, 12. All right, um, choose two. Okay. Um, I am going to uh, get many of them. All right. Um, and I'm going to control the collateral damage because I don't want to hit. Because Bryn is still kind of nearby, right? Yes. Yeah, I'm like still there. Okay. I don't want to hit Bryn. Okay. Um, so you managed to stab. Uh, we'll say three of them. Okay. You managed to have three of them. Just. The chest, the gut, the oh god, we're all yeah. bleeding. Okay. You basically have them all on a shish, shish kebab, a shish sword. And another one is going to just come up behind you and hit you with the blunt end of their dagger right in the head. Ugh. Oof. You are concussed. No! That'll be a status of three. Oh man, okay. All right. I would like to p try to pull one of the ones that didn't get shish kebobbed. <laughs> All right. I would like to try to pull that one and take off his mask oh, and peel it off. So gross. Oh, peel it. Yeah. Not like take off his head. Like I want to see what potentially what we can get from this person. Okay. I'm going to need two rolls from you. Okay. That's fine. First, I'm going to have to have you roll to face danger because okay. this thing is not right. going to do this. It's not going to do this quietly. Yes. Um, 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 uh, friends versus foes. Oh, uh, um, good with animals. <laughs> Also allowed. Really? <laughs> yes, you have a pig with you. True. Oh, I oh. Do. Piggy. Thanks, Piggy. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> One and two. Ooh. Um, Thanks. I won't re-roll. I'll let us have some fun with that. Okay. Um. Uh -oh. oh man. All right. <laughs> so your bleeding says it's at two. Yep. Yeah. Bump that up to a three. Okay. Oof. He's. As you try to wrestle it off him, he's just flailing wildly and he slices you in the face. I'm already burned all over now. It can be cut mm -hmm. on my face. You look really fucking metal. Yeah, I look real good. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, who wants a spotlight? Um, <clears throat> is there a way to, like, heal people? Yes, uh, you can change the game. Mm. Um, okay. Interesting. But we still have a few of them up, right? Yes. Uh, yeah, I think, I mean, I heard about the pulling the head off thing, so I'll just go over and grab one and just pop. Yeah. Okay, uh, I'm going to need the two rolls from you. First is going to be the face danger. Okay. Just to kind of, like, get a grapple on him. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, heart of a lion. Fair enough. Uh, loyal to the end. I don't know how that's how, how, about how does that work here. I'm <laughs> I'm helping them. How, how about uh, I'm a survivor. I'll allow that. Okay, so would you like to, you can also use Jared. You can oh assist. yeah. Uh, Yar, I'm still here. Jared, confuse that guy too as well. As yo ho, yo ho! I'm an invisible pirate. How are you doing? <laughs> Fuck you. It's a nine. That's a nine. Okay. Um, you are going to. So it works. You managed to get a grapple on him. 
But you do uh, take a status one. Okay. As you are sliced. They all have identical daggers. They're just... You're just giving me a new cool scar. Yes. <laughs> a cooler scar. Uh, um, so now you can roll to change the game to remove the pig head. Mm -hmm. Okay. So... Uh... Hmm. I don't know that I have anything good to roll for this one, so I'll just roll it. Uh, oh my god. Oh. <laughs> I got two ones. Okay. I rolled a two. All right. Oh Watch god. this! Why <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this so hard? Um... While you're trying to do that, the other still standing legion is going to just tackle you. Oh, good. And you feel something slimy kind of touch the back of your head, and you realize, oh god, they have another pig head. No! <laughs> okay, what do you guys do? Okay, so I haven't removed my sword. No. I want to just slice it upwards. I'm not going to make you roll to do that because you already all, you had them all like that. Okay. So it is, uh, God, I'm just making all sorts of slasher movie references today. <laughs> it is very much Jason's Dead, The Final Nightmare, as you just lift it up and... Nice. They all just kind of... Banana Boy. peel. Great. <laughs> okay. Ugh. So there's a pig head that they're trying to put on... Yes. No. On Dusty. No! Okay. <laughs> I've been there, so that makes me very mad. Of course. So I'm going to throw my sword at the pig head. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, I think that's pretty stupid because, like, I feel like it could easily... Hit Dusty. Hit <laughs> Dusty. Say it all with me now. Take <laughs> the, the risk! risk. <laughs> um, okay. I'm going to use... Uh, can I use Incorruptible for this? Because I'm trying to stop Dusty from being corrupted. Sure, why not? I'll okay. that one. Well, because I'm trying to make up for this right now. So, yeah. uh, Incorruptible, uh, Cut You Down, and Wrathful. So then that leaves me a fl uh, flat. Yes. Okay, great. Oh, God. Oh, no, what am I doing? <laughs> I'm trying to take, take the risk. <laughs> oh. I'm this is so stupid. <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> Megan, do you mind handing me that stabbed this tag real quick? Yeah. Sliced. Sliced, oh, no. yes. Um, I'm sorry! Just stabbed. Uh, I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm trying to help. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that's... Uh, your sword goes a little too low. Oh no. <laughs> you kind of hit Dusty right in the gut. Oh uh, no, oh, that's oh. a lot too low. <laughs> <laughs> Missy! <laughs> Is the other guy still, I've had worse. I don't know, with me? Uh, he's still, like, one of them grappling? is pin Uh, yeah, you're still grappling. Okay. So grapple. So, one has you pinned, trying to put the thing on, and you're stabbed, so they're it's going a little easier now. Mm -hmm. You're swordless, and you're, gra you're grappling with one, so. Um, I may have to do two rolls for this. Okay, um, that's what we want But to I want to see if I can stab... Like, this fucker. Like, in the head. Like, you know what? I was gonna try to save you, but I just wanna, like, <laughs> take him out. Eh, too much and then I wanna, like, simultaneously, at, like, if I do that, I wanna turn around and throw my spear at, not at the head, but at the pig that's trying to pull the head off you. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Dusty. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Witch Slapped. Oh, Witch Slapped, oh, thank, thank you. Thank you, Witch Slapped. Thank you. Thank you, Boobala. Okay, so, first off, you're gonna have to roll to hit with all you've got. Yes. Okay. Um, which is, okay, which is to stab this dude. Yes. Um, so I'm gonna use, um, hmm, uh, cut any material. Okay. To get through the friggin' pig head. All right. Um, and don't forget you're bleeding, so... I am bleeding. Yeah. And I'm at three. Mm -hmm. Um... Uh... 
grows to full size. Can I use my knives? Um, you'd have to use your knives instead of your spear, but I'd allow it. Mm, no, not gonna help me. Um, because I get more with my spear. Um. Uh. Marks, no, marksmanship, I have to wait until I throw it. Um, if I can justify emotional distance to you, can I use it? Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> you were about to do soup something kind of noble, and now you're just like, eh, let the fucker okay. die. Yeah, great. So I'm rolling, I'm still rolling flat. You're rolling flat. Uh, four, <laughs> I am rolling flat. <laughs> 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 Is this the episode where everyone dies? <laughs> Everyone throws blades at Dusty. <laughs> yep. No, this isn't for the throwing one. This is for, oh, for the stabbing. Oh, no, this okay. is for the stabbing. So you try to stab, and this thing is just fighting back and forth. You cannot get a good... You yeah. can't do it. Yeah. However, I am nothing if not nice. I will allow you to, uh, you know, javelin the motherfucker. Oh, God. Okay. Um... Let's do that. <laughs> this is gonna be a take the yeah, risk, though. Yeah, this is a take the risk. Mm -hmm. Oh god. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you're still. Bleeding. Megan, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's good. I'm good. Um. <laughs> okay. Uh. Marksmanship. Yes. Uh. Cut any material. Okay. Rose to full size. Yes. Uh, emotional distance. Fuck yeah. Um, and I would like to use distracting echo. Oh. Um, to at least sort of throw these fuckers off their game, if I can do nothing else. Okay. Um, so I'm rolling with two. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that was a take the risk. Things get Things messy. Things get messy. Oh, God. Um, <laughs> you manage... All right, all right. So you throw it, and you stab... Where do you stab this pig? Where do you stab this pig on top of uh, Dusty? Um, I was going... Well, how is it facing me? Uh, it had its back to you, we'll say. Um, like, like, at... Like, right in between... The shoulders. Okay, I guess. I'll love it. Like right in like the meaty part of someone's back. All right. So y this thing is on top of you, and then <laughs> the spear comes out, and it doesn't hit. It does not hit you. I just imagine it's like here, I'm like ah, oh. <laughs> good. And good. he flops over dead, and but while he dies, the spear falls over, hits the fire alarm. Oh no! And the sprinklers have gone off. So, we're just gonna tap, we're just gonna give it the story tag, fucking mess. Fucking Great. mess. Great. So. And I'm still grappling with this fuck. Yes. In front of me. So who would like the spotlight now? Uh, so what's happening with the thing on, so it- This thing's dead, it flopped off you. Okay. Uh, the fire alarm's going off. Sirens are blaring. Water's coming down. This sucks. Okay. And uh, how many are left? One. Just the one that I'm pack. grappling with. Yes. Um, can someone grab my spear? <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Uh, could I... How far away is her spear? Um, pretty close to you, actually. It'd be pretty far for either of them that's close to you. And you're grappling with one? Yeah. I mean, I'd really like to be able to pick up the spear and throw it back into the one she's grappling with, so I'm like, here! <laughs> but I also try and take him out at the same time. I'll allow it. Okay. What am I using? With you're going to go, uh, you're going to hit with all you got. Okay. Also, Kirsten has given a reroll to Missy. Oh! Yay! Yay! Thank you, Kirsten! I need this real bad. <laughs> <laughs> you all do. That's true. Uh, okay. I've gone through a couple tonight. We're rolling kind of messy tonight. And I'm not giving them away anymore, so. No. <laughs> um, okay. So, loyal to the end here? Sure. Loyal. 
Um, uh, could I... Could I use um, Protected by Thunder? In that I'm pr trying to protect her? I mean, I do control weather. I'll allow that. <laughs> okay. And then... Um, um, especially since you did give a story tag earlier. You did change the game earlier to give the story tag of the storm. So. Okay, oh yeah. And then, um, can I use... Can I say... So I like to imagine that I'm here and the sphere is like right there. I'm like, Jared, bring it to me. And so it like flies into my head and then I throw it. Yar. <laughs> I'll allow Jared. Jared. All right. So that's Ghost three. Jared. Ooh, that's uh, 10, 11, 12, 13. All Woo. right. Um, even with your slice tag of three, it's still a 10. So oh, nice. you're hitting with all you got. So Jared pulls the spear out, hands it to you dramatically. You chuck it. How does it hit this thing? Um, I mean, I like to imagine that it goes in the back of the head and right through one eye. Nice. So it's just like, there. There's your spear! And there's an eye <laughs> dangling out the end. Now is it a pig eye or a human eye? Is both. both? Yeah! yeah. So it's an eye kebab. <laughs> <laughs> so many shish kebabs. I've been doing so many shish kebabs tonight. Mm-hmm. There's a place down the road. You guys want to go later? <laughs> I'm in the mood now. <laughs> um, so, they're all dead. Mm -hmm. Congrats. Brynn stands up and takes the spear out and sort of and pulls off the eyes and holds it, holds it up to like wash it off. It's a good idea. Okay, you still hear the screaming of the woman who you Back tied up earlier. Yeah. I'm gonna run into her, to where she is. Okay, uh, you come in and you see they, you didn't see what they did to Poseidon, mm -hmm. where they just kind of mutilated him and everything. Thankfully, they were not able to do much to her apart from me, apart from like kind of slice what looks like an alpha in her okay. hand. Um, she looks freaked the fuck out. And she does not know what to make of you right now. Mm -hmm. So what do you do? And she's tied up. So. I'm gonna, uh, I wanna calm her down. I just wanna roll to convince. Okay. Um, Your concussed will not apply here. Okay, do I have any, like, I mean, I know I look real bad. Does, is that a I'm not, tag? We didn't make that a tag, so okay, don't great. worry about it. All right, um, I'm going to uh, use Always Appears Professional. <laughs> Uh, and incorruptible. Mm -hmm. I'll allow it. And those are the ones that I will use. Okay. Uh, That's a one. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Great. So I want to like get down on her level and say like. Everything's going to be f just fine, okay? Let's inhale four mm. counts, hold eight counts, and exhale through the mouth. Girl, will you Seven fucking untie me? Okay. Please. Okay, she trusts me. She trusts me. Oh, good. That's good. That's a plus. I want to untie her. <laughs> okay, you untie her. It's not that hard. Uh, you kind of like motor memory. Remember how you did this? Yeah. So. Leave. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. This is... And she just starts walking out. Uh, maybe we get yeah, wait before you go. I mean, can we talk to you about how you got here and yes Outside I'm leaving this place. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, if it's just outside. I'm okay with outside and She goes to a fire exit throws it open the alarms going anyway <clears throat> And you are now behind the building mm -hmm. uh, We no longer have the story tag of fucking mess mm -hmm. Because uh, you're no longer in that fucking mess okay. uh, On the way out I grab my sword from where it had fallen. Good call. So you're behind the, what was for once the white club, now the gray club. She's wringing out her hair. She, and she's very pretty and her eyes are just polished silver. You can see yourselves when you look at, and when you look at them. Ugh. Well, Wish you got there before they got my DJ hand, but still, thank you for rescuing me. Wait, wait, why is it that they wanted you? Well, I'm the magic mirror. Oh, oh. The, the eye thing, that makes more sense now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Interesting. Thor. Yeah, you can tell. I like that. Kind of a guess. You're big, you're pretty, you're blonde. Kind of figured. Yeah, yeah. Goes with the territory, I suppose. Yes. No idea who either of you are, but, uh... Missy grabs you by the shoulders and says, Where's Paul? And, like, looks at your eyes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna need your ro <laughs> roll to convince. And we're gonna get her a negative two on that one. Yeah. <laughs> Is Paul another friend of yours who's Legion has control Paul's over? Paul's her husband. But he Legion doesn't have... Okay. He... He's missing! He was, okay. He was gone. <laughs> <laughs> you rolled a one on two dimes. I'm not even gonna use a reroll on that. <laughs> Girl, back up. Sorry. Back up. Three steps. Thank you. Had a try. Okay. You know what? I just got I just got attacked by uh you know. Fucking pigs. I. I'm having a day. It's okay. I'm having a day. <sighs> Damn it. All right, so, do you two have a question? Not you. Uh, where did they take you from? I worked here. I was closing the bar. Well, what, what do they want with this place, then? Is it about you, or is it about the place? Or both? It's about me. Oh, well, there you go. There's your answer. Oh, that? Oh. I'm oh. mirror mirror on the wall who's the fairest. Yeah, I know things. Well, then, do you know anything about a Veritas? Oh. Okay, that's why she did that. Okay, uh, all right. Um. Boy, who did what? So, Veritas is using Legion to kill Rifts. Yes. And she's stealing <clears throat> what makes them special. To do what with? For herself? From what I... Well, yeah. Well, I didn't know You want a better look? Just get real close real quick. Just get real close. Um, as you peer into her eye, you do see... Um, the most plain-looking person. You're not even sure if they're... You're not sure their gender, their ethnicity, their age. Everything about them is just sort of obtuse. <laughs> yes, yes. They look like a stick figure. And you see something behind them getting bigger. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> Let me just run that one out. Yeah, there we go. That's what he said. Mm -hmm. So... Well, thank you. You're welcome. Yes. Missy. You know? Yes. I got answers for you, but you're not gonna like them, kid. She's younger than you. You're not sure why yeah. she calls you kid, yeah. but like. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm sure it's not. Well, we can, we can talk more later then. Sure. It can wait then. All right. Go ahead and mark crack on your mission. So. Do you know where Veritas is? Okay, that was a fun one. Uh. Veritas is somewhere. They're in the city. I know, it's super helpful. Sorry, if you can give me like her human name, that tends to work easier for me. Or at least some details about her. I do. Here you go. That's cute. Yeah, Where'd that's her. That? I didn't draw it. Oh. You got a cute pig too. Okay, so I like pigs. Good to know that about myself. She talked to a priest once. Wait, okay, what? that helps. You saw her? Oh, 
I had a day, let me tell you, I was just, I was in this awful place that was just like all pigs. It was horrible. There was no sense of organization to it. Um, I was in this 2D place. Anyway, long story short, I met Legion before he became Legion, when he was a child, and then he became an adult, and he was not a cute adult. He was, like, not cute. He then became a priest. He met this uh, person, this lady, this Veritas, and they were talking in a church, and she gave him a pig head, and he got all freaked, and I guess that's when he became Legion. A church in this, here, in the city? <clears throat> I... Yeah, I guess it would have to be. Is Did it, you recognize it? Yeah, I would recognize it. I mean, I, I, I spent some time in the confessional booth. Okay. okay. That's useful. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Can you describe him for me real quick? It helps if I know what I'm looking for exactly. He's... Blonde. Okay, helpful. Slightly upturned nose. She glances down at your pig. Not like that. No, I'm just noticing motif. Oh, mm hmm Yeah. Um, like I said, priest. Um, had a little bit of a unibrow going on. Ugh, unfortunate. I think those are, you know, I didn't notice him to be exceptionally tall or... Okay, that can work. That works. Okay. All right. Um, okay, I'm gonna do some a little kumbaya. Do you guys mind joining me real quick? Uh, are we singing a song? Holding hands at the very least. Oh, okay, sure. Okay, sure. Okay. 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 I'm like covered in blood. <laughs> yeah. Still bleeding. Uh, remind me to wash my hands later. Okay. I just, she tries to like wipe it on her apron. <laughs> Now I need all of you to roll me an investigate check with, uh, plus three. Uh, eight. Ten. Eleven. Alright. You know exactly where this place is now. <gasps> oh. Did it work? Yeah. Hot dog. Alright, we're going. Oh, I like this. I'm gonna go find God. God? So not really, no. no. Oh. I'm just, I was trying to be... Because I'm one of those. Yeah, also. Right. Yeah, we oh. all are. So we're gonna go find a guy who... who... Whatever. Let's just go. We're gonna go. Okay, I'm gonna leave you guys this one. I'm gonna go home, lock my doors, probably remove all the doors from my closet, just kind of... Wash kinda hands. Wash my everything, probably burn this outfit. Maybe quit. I don't know. Maybe we'll move to Bermuda. Who knows? I'm having one of those days. Hmm. And she sashays out of the story for the evening. Now, question. You know exactly where it is. Mm -hmm. How are you going to get there? God, I mean, I, it would be nice if I had my van nearby. Where is my van? You're going to have to roll to investigate for that one. Oh, God. Okay. We also have whatever we came in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. True. What well, you guys came in? What did we come in? We came, was it a... Oh, did you guys get a ride like from a someone? Driver. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was like, yeah. Oh, yeah, but you guys had a driver. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we did. Veronica's car. All right. Uh, Victoria's. Sorry. There. So if... I've been listening to Heather's a lot. It's not my fault. If you guys want, we could just go in, in, yeah. in that car. Yeah. I can also... Uh, Jared, can you uh, take a quick look around the city and see if you can find this minivan? Yeah, I can do that. Any year old me an Good investigation. Man. Good man, Jared. <laughs> Can the squirrels go with him? <laughs> uh, how many squirrels do you have with you? I don't think I have any. I don't have my drones tonight. Yeah. Mm. Uh, which one am I rolling? You're rolling and investigate with uh, plus one. Do you have any other tags that might work? Uh, not really. Unless I <laughs> call down some Valkyries. So sure, why not? Because I still have this negative, right? Yes. So I'm actually a negative one. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I rolled two sixes. Nice. So that's an 11. Okay. I aced him. Nice. Uh, he vanishes into the ether. 
and then reforms like 30 seconds later. Yar, it's like four blocks that way. Oh, oh. well, okay. that was easy. Yeah. Now we have two cars. Very convenient. Quite. It's almost like we want to wrap up this plot thread real fast and just kind of move on. Yeah. It's a strange way of talking you got there, Jaren. I always liked that about you. Well, well I, I am kind of a meta pirate. Mm. Okay, well, I say we use the van. Yeah, we can go get your... We yeah, because we can use quality van. matters. Yeah. For, uh, so, all right, well, the van's and close the minivan. by. And the power tower. Yeah, and the minivan. So, uh, I say we just get in the car and, and I mean, I, I, uh, let's go. We gotta, we gotta yeah. go. Yeah, let's do it. So you find your van. It's not far. Moana and Michael Buble start playing. They're blasting. They're Every both time. blasting mm -hmm. on top of one another. Gotta love like that. Climb in the back. <laughs> oh yeah, that works. <laughs> it works. Uh, where do you? Put and I Dusty? swear that it's the pig this time. I'm like, it's the pig. Oh yeah, Dusty. Uh, Dusty can take shotgun <laughs> in the van. Oh yeah. I imagine I like hang my head out the window. Yeah. Mm. Oh yeah, uh, it's good because all the windows a, are broken. Uh, Perfect. Wine cooler in the. Uh, Who's this? drinking this? Strawberry kiwi. That was gross. Drink something oh, those better. Oh, those are for Mander. Oh, well, yeah, clearly a problem. Gotta get some good mead or ale or something. As you drive through the city. Um, on your way. We're actually going to invoke the montage. Montage! Yes. So montage basically allows all of you to do one of the actions on the list. Um, I would like to recover. You can recover. Um, do, do I go down one? Do I take it away completely? How does this work? Uh, let's see. You are <clears throat> choosing to recover from your last activity. Uh, you can reduce your, uh, any major physical related statuses by two. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Down to one. Okay. I'm also going to recover. All right. I will also do I'm not so, so I'm going to do it down, down to one. Oozing. All right. Great. And. Uh, okay. And how do I do that? How do I utilize this to recover? Uh, you have about an hour of just kind of like in this car. It's kind of like driving through Los Angeles. You got plenty of time to just kind of focus on yourself for a minute. I also sure. have back teen in the car. Mm, yes. Perfect. So you find yeah, some I'm Advil for your, slices. you know, yeah, bonk yeah. on the head. Yeah. You've, there's back teen and bandages for you guys. Shove that in this hole here. <laughs> <Ew>. <laughs> so that puts me at a what? Well, that lowers it from a three to a one. Okay. Yes. Thank you. You find yourself in a part of town you never want to go to. Do I know this part of town? You do. Okay. It's you actually grew up in this part of yeah. town more often than not. A couple decades ago, they tried to revitalize it as an arts district, but now it's just kind of a joke. Yeah. Um, as you drive through the arts district, you see... Uh, small shanty villages, decrepit uh, slums. It is very far away from the ocean. <sighs> um, nature would not touch this place. So you fucking hate it. Yeah, I know it and hate it. Even though the windows are broken, I press uh, the lock, <laughs> power lock. <laughs> I'd probably stick my head back in. This, <laughs> this place is, does not smell right. And you- I know some people here. Yeah. You I, do. I imagine they don't smell right either. <laughs> I don't know how you could. In all fairness, none of you smell right. No, we all smell this, terrible. This is also <laughs> I'm literally bleeding. I'm mm. covered in decayed pig. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's like Carrie, but gross. But yeah. I do have a teacup pig, which I feel like makes me mm. marginally more. And that pig right. smells great. Right. That pig smells so cute. <laughs> it smells cute. Yeah, it smells so cute. <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> yeah. Um. You pull up to a church. It's large, it's imposing, I guess it's Catholic. There's a large stained glass mural above it that's been shattered a couple times over now, and there's a barbed wire fence around the whole thing and a large condemned sticker on the front. Yeah, I slept here a couple times. Yeah. I didn't say I liked it. What do you do? Well, we should go in, right? Yeah, I say we go in. Yeah. I kick the back open. <laughs> Get out. So you kick the back open. Um, now, are you guys going to sneak in or are you going to bur burst in? How? What do you want to do exactly? 
I would like to sneak. Ah, oh, okay, we can try that. That sounds interesting. I'm up for a challenge. <laughs> All right. Okay. It looks at you. It's quite That's adorable. not good sneaking. It winks quietly. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> All right. So. I also speak piggy, not just squirrel. <laughs> Sure, why not? You speak with all animals. I do. You're a fucking Disney princess. <laughs> covered in blood. <laughs> all right, so... Uh, Moana's... <laughs> we're like, we're gonna sneak! Moana's <laughs> Moana's <laughs> Moana. Tells me! <laughs> oh, Moana, the, ki- the gift that keeps on giving. You know Jordan doesn't like that movie? Frigid, not your dad. Really? Yeah. I like that movie. I love that movie. He's, he's dumb. He also says GIF instead of GIF. But, you know, what? He does. Uh, you guys haven't come upon this yet? No! This is an argument at Wild Grounds oh. all the time. Anyway, that's a different thing entirely. <laughs> oh, geez. I'm scandalized. Please. My night is ruined. Yeah. He takes it very seriously, so I, I don't recommend arguing with him about it. I will oh. not, but I will keep this in my mind. This anger is seed. real. There's a seed of hatred. <laughs> all right. So I'm going to need a sneak roll from you guys. Okay. Now... S'mores kit. <laughs> <laughs> Not applicable, Which I still but delicious. Mm. Okay, so your conc- your physical will not apply. Okay. So your concussed, your stabbed, your bleeding okay. will not apply here. Okay, I'm gonna use tracking, snooping around, and incredibly observant. All right, so you'll be taking the lead on this one. Okay. Yeah. I don't have anything good for this. I'm mostly very loud. <laughs> you so. are Thor. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. So I'll just roll. You can roll flat. Um, yeah. Oh Holy fuck. Oh, wow. I actually did. Okay. Are you kidding me? I'm, I'm going to use my reroll. All right. That was Ooh. awful. What'd you roll? I rolled a three. Oof. So we'll try that again. There okay. You go. There we go. There we go. There we go. That will work. So that's 11 plus 3, 12, 13, 14. A 9. I'm going to use uh, Distracting Echo. Nice. Um, And perhaps Independence, because I feel either, either Independence or Stubbornness, something about knowing this area. Does that? I'll allow it. Allow? So I'm rolling with 2. Six, eight. Okay. So how are you sneaking in? Missy, you you were taking the lead, so right. you'll um, set So uh, I looked for, uh, like, I'm assuming <coughs> this has been abandoned for a while. Mm-hmm. So I think I'm, I looked for a spot where, like, some of the chain link had been, like, pulled up from the bottom and, like, shimmied under. Um, and then, uh, like very low to the ground, snuck to um, the wall, and are any of the windows broken? Uh, most of them. Okay. Um, she threw her cardigan onto the side of the window, so she went cut her fingers, and then like pulled herself up and looked inside, uh, and is there anybody there? We'll address that real quick. Okay. So you roll a nine, correct? Mm-hmm. And what? An eight. An eight. So you guys follow her lead. You slip under there. And you're using your echoing powers, correct? Mm-hmm. And you're big. I'm just, yeah. I'm just, like, trying to be quiet. Um, <laughs> your hammer, your little toy hammer, <laughs> catches onto the chain link. I don't know. It does that. Sometimes. And you managed to pull it off, but because of your echo, it kind of reverberates. <laughs> now, as you guys... Now, you aren't going to be noticed by the big bad, but as you are sneaking around... Oh. Missy. Yes? As you look inside, you see an entire congregation of Legion. Oh. Wow. Bryn saw about a hundred of them back at the water park. And it looks like there's about that many here. But standing at the front, it's the only one where the pig head is blinking and it's animated. That has to be the core one. Yeah. And he's giving oh, a sermon. No. <laughs> has to be, he's giving a sermon. And then he, you hear it first. 
as you hear a <laughs> and ec- the echo from the chain oh, link fence God, moving oh, no. back and forth. And we're both like. And Legion looks. <laughs> I'm like I'm like holding the pig's ears as if that's gonna do anything. Yeah. <laughs> the Legion leader looks around. They know. They have sensed you, but they've only heard you. They can't see you, smell you, or any, uh, or anything else. Mm. Well, they know we're here. Okay. So what do you do? Keep going. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they heard. Get over here as quick as you can. They heard it from all the way back there. Okay. 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 Um, I want to drop in, uh, towards the back. Okay, you're gonna have to give me another sneak. Okay. I'm rolling with the same three. Okay. (laughs) Don't fuck this up for me. (laughs) 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 Okay, so four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I just make it, but... It is it's over complicated. 10. It's complicated. I'm gonna say you leave something important behind. Oh no, what? Oh, okay, I will give you an option. You can leave something important behind or be discovered. Oh. Can I pick up whatever you leave behind? <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna say, uh, I'm gonna say your sword. Oh no. Is it gone forever? It won't be gone forever. I'm not an asshole. Okay, I'll I'll leave the sword behind. Okay. Um, you crash down through. You come down through the window and you land silently, but your sword falls and it makes a crap up, and you dive behind a pillar. As several the legions are aware now. Okay. And some of them come over and they are sniffing around, looking. They find your sword, and one of them picks it up. But they don't see you. And they're not sure what to do with the sword, and they just kind of bring it up towards the front of this church. What are you two doing? Maybe we should electrocute them. If I... It's so stressful, she had to leave. (laughs) Are they... Are they touching the floor? The pigs? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I didn't know if they were like sitting down or if they're if or if they were physically touching the floor. Uh they're touching the floor with their feet. Right. If I make it rain, can you electrocute the ground? Yes. <laughs> yes I can. I love out of the box thinking. Okay. Uh power over weather. Alright. All weather. Okay. Um. S'mores kit? S'mores kit? No. No. Um. Can I use distracting echo to try to get them away from... From where they're sniffing? Or at Uh, least to try to... Um, so that's that they don't know where it's change- coming from? Well, you are rolling change the game, yeah. so I will allow you to use Or just that. at least just use it? Yeah, I will allow you right. to use it. Alright, that's three. Uh, I think that's it. Uh, ten. Okay. Mm. So, you have three juice to spend. Okay, I will... What would you like to do? I will, um, create a story tag. Alright, what story tag would you like? Um, wet. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna. I'm also gonna get rid of. I'm gonna get rid of this. All right. So you're burning one juice. Yes. And that is another juice. Um. And I will. Wet. <laughs> oh. oh. I will hide the effect. Yay! <laughs> Smart decision. So you use your powers. You kind of like. How do you heal your wound? Um. 
I think it, it's, I, it's a little bit of, my, it's like holding my spear, sort of like how I healed hers with, um, what did I, I cauterized her wound. I feel like I do something similar, like with my spear. It's like I sort of All right. burn it. I'm already covered in burns. So I just... So you cauterize... And everyone realizes that maybe that's where all the burns are from. <laughs> you cauterize the wound and send out this rain cloud yeah. into the church. And you hear people are panicking. And you hear what must be Legion proper, Legion with a capital L, uh, trying to calm them down. But it's not working as the entire congregation is just... They're wet. <laughs> they're wet. Okay. What would you like to do, Dusty? I would like to, uh, I, I imagine that I can kind of pull it into my own hands, so I just want to, so they're in this church, right? Yes. So I'm, I essentially imagine I'm like leaning over a window or uh -huh. something and just I imagine shooting, both of you are leaning over the window. Yeah, yeah. Shooting electricity down into the floor, into the water. Oh, that's, that's. Fucked up. Oh All right, uh, you are rolling to change the game. Okay, can I use uh, create a storm? Yes, obviously. Ride the lightning. Thunderstorms. Okay. Bigger oh, boom. I hope Missy isn't on the ground. Right. Oh yeah. Missy is. Jump. <laughs> okay, uh, you're also using wet, so you're okay. rolling with five. Sweet. Uh, that's uh, eleven. 16. Yeah, so that well works. You have five juice. Okay. So, uh, let's prolong the effect. <laughs> okay. Yes. Um, um, oh, can I, I'll scale up the effect. Greater oh, area or more targets. Okay. Uh, I can do five of these. Uh, you can do that, and you can also make any other improvement you and I agree on. My stomach really needs to shut the fuck up. <laughs> I did too. Um, give a reduce, give a reduce a stat. I mean, I feel like I should re give a status to these guys, right? Um, yeah, that's fair. Uh, electrocuted. Shocked part two. Shocked part two. Okay. <laughs> um, Fried. Burned. We're gonna give him fried. Upset. Okay. Uh, Missy? Mm. I'm gonna need you to roll a face danger real quick. Sorry, girl. Uh oh. Uh. You can tell what's going to happen, so I'm not gonna give you a negative anywhere on this. Okay. One. Spider climb the can walls. Can I use incredibly observant? Hell yeah. Okay. There we go. I'm gonna use one of my rerolls for you. Oh, Whoa. thank you. Because I am nothing if not nice. You are nice. Be better. <laughs> God damn. That's worse. It's oh. horrible. Just wasn't meant to be. So I got five. This is too stressful. <laughs> it's too much. So. No. <laughs> yeah. Uh, sorry. It's okay. I have to obey the rules. <laughs> Zapped. I'm zapped! Yes. As you bring down the lightning, mm -hmm. and once again Thunderstruck for the third show in, third episode in a row, starts playing a little bit in the back of your mind, mm -hmm. um, you realize, oh wait, she's, oh wait, Missy's down there. <laughs> oh, <Missy's> you <laughs> I did stab you, so <laughs> I go, wah, wah, uh, uh, and it's already happening. As all these pigs just start dropping dead, um, Missy, thankfully, is technically a god, mm. Mm -hmm. but you kind of got the poof going on. Okay. You know when you put your hands on a yeah, yeah. on the thingy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And you are zapped. I'm zapped. Oh yeah. Zapped. Okay. So, from where I am. There's water everywhere. There's Electricity water everywhere. has mm -hmm. just happened. And a However, bunch of these. They dropped your sword. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go get my sword. Okay. Roll to uh, face danger. Okay. Um Okay. Uh 
No, that was work. So I'm trying this tracking. <laughs> I see it. Seven. Seven plus anything? No, I didn't. I don't. I didn't really have anything. Okay. Um, Incredibly observant. Yeah, yeah, still cause... put you in the seven to ten. Yeah. Seven to nine. Uh, you gain two ticks on your zap as you try to dodge the lightning oh my God. crashing around you. Whoa! Yeah! It doesn't make it as four, but it does add two ticks. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, no! So, lightning is just falling around you. You see these pigs just get struck and drop dead, and it's... it's have you seen Carrie? Why am I asking? Yes. Of course you've seen mm -hmm. Carrie. I, I, re I listened to your podcast. Yay. Yeah, no. Um, it's the final scene of Carrie. These pigs are just dropping dead. Yeah. Okay. They're dropping like flies, and you get you grab your sword, and a lightning bolt just hits you in the back. It hurts like a motherfucker, but oh, you're okay. Okay. Who wants the spotlight? So we got pigs dropping dead. Yes. What's daddy pig doing? Um, he seems to just be watching. Ew. Mm. Ew. It's fucked up. What yeah. A dick. <laughs> Maybe uh. he also likes bacon. <laughs> Would that be cannibalism? I don't know. I don't know, because is he a pig? He's a pig head. I mean, if anything, he's like a pig furry. Oh. Interesting. Mm. It's a pig sona, if you will. Yeah. I'm not apologizing for that one. <laughs> so. But I do have my sword. No. You have sword. your sword now. Okay. Um, but I am zapped. And stop right there. Again? Yeah. No. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Uh. Bryn and Dusty had just made kind of a miniature lightning storm inside the pig church. Most of the piggies are being fried, and sadly, uh, oh. Missy got hit. So got zapped. Got zapped. But I have yep. a sword again. But you do have your sword. Yeah. So, what would you guys like to do? Um, also, Legion with a capital L just seems to be watching. Mm-hmm. We need to go after that guy. Yeah. Um... Uh, using marksmanship, criminals, and knives. <laughs> <laughs> and knives. And knives. Um, I want to throw them at his head across the church. Okay. The knives, I mean. Obviously. Nine, 10, 11, 12. Ooh, all right, nice. so this is not hit with all you got. This is going toe to toe. Yes. So, you rolled over 10. Um, I am going to... Uh, get him good. All right. Um, and I want... Knives. I, like, chuck chuck through his eyes. Yeah. Um... And then, I guess, counter his best attempt? Right? Um, okay. I guess. Like, do I give him a status? I give him a status of tier plus power? Yes. <coughs> okay. Um, so you're going to block whatever he <coughs> counters you with, and yeah. you're going to do that. Yeah. I'm okay, so what status are you giving him? Um, I mean, he has knives in his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> knives Knife in the eyes! eyes. <laughs> Knife eyes! eyes. Key hand, lock hand, knife eyes. So I did give him weapons, but blind. I also made him blind. I have a thing about No, no, it's not blind, it's knife eyes. It's knife eyes. And knife that's eyes. Knife eyes. Knife eyes. Yeah. All right. All the legions, including the ones that are obviously dead, start speaking in unison. Ooh. You think I need those to see? No. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> it was just a good place to aim. It's fucking idiot. All right, who would like the spotlight? Mm. Prince getting sassy. Prince is clearly <laughs> getting sassy. Getting more used to people. I like it. She's I mean, like, no. I feel like I should just call down one lightning bolt right for this guy. I mean, why not? Right for knife eyes. Okay, for you're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. Knife eyes. Okay. Um, create a storm. Thunderstorms. Bigger boom. Ride the lightning. 
Does this go away now that I use this? Or do I keep it? Do um, I just have like never ending knives? We're gonna go ahead and burn that story tag okay. as you have used it. I rolled 12 plus 4. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so that's going toe to toe. What would you like to do? 16. Um, <clears throat> I would like to achieve my goal of electrocuting knife eyes. <laughs> okay. Uh, and I'll get them good. And I'll say he's singed. His All knife right. eyes are singed. <laughs> The lightning hits the knife eyes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so what too. tag is what? Uh, how much power would this tag be? Um. What did you roll with? I rolled with four. Okay. Extra. So, all right. So Ooh. that's that is four. Wow. Singed. Sure. Very very singed eyes. Singed eyes. Singed okay. knife eyes. Singed knife uh, eyes. Woof. He is gonna give you a status in turn though. Uh oh. Ew. Um, you feel a sudden blinding pain in your eyes, Aww, as if really? someone just stabbed you with that. Oh, that doesn't feel good. I don't like knife eyes. <laughs> you gain says three knife eyes. Okay. Do these stack? Do all of your uh, statuses like what I do? Uh, I mean, I assume they do for rolls. Depends on the status and what you're doing. Okay. So you're kind you have you've been knife dyed. No oh, no. Okay. Yes. Um feel a searing blinding pain and you notice this and even though you stab this walking talking pig man in the eyes, he seems pretty chill. Who wants the spotlight? Can I uh, roll to change the game to get some of these down? Yes. Okay, because right now I'm pretty fucked if I try and do anything. Uh, okay, um, I want to roll to change the game to lower my zapped. Okay, uh, how are you trying to change the game? Um, so Missy in her purse has a bunch of um, dryer sheets. <laughs> <laughs> so she wants to like rub them on herself to reduce <laughs> <laughs> the electricity. <laughs> oh, oh what? <laughs> That's the I just, like, you in the corner going, <laughs> like, a bunch of dryer sheets. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, God. I don't have anything that can help with that. <laughs> so... What about always prepared? I Is that always you're... prepared. You know I have always appears professional. Mm, but you know, follow. that I'll does, because I'm fixing my look. Yes. Okay. So I'll do that, plus that. Rule one of running up any Apocalypse World game. Be a fan. <laughs> and okay. what you got? Six. Six. The one day you forgot the fucking dryer sheets. <laughs> we cut back to <laughs> Missy's home in Rolling Hills and sitting on the kitchen counter, nice new box of down new dryer sheets. Oh man. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Um, and with that, Legion kind of takes a few steps forward, enough, and your storm dissipates. Rude. Bleeding from the eyes, hands outstretched, Legion announces, it's going to take much more than you to end me. Oh, there we go. And that is where we're going to call it. Oh my it god. Wow. Yes, we are. So now we go. So before we wrap, every night, I don't know if you're familiar with this, we geek out over the credits. Okay. Which is actually a move you have on your cheat sheet. Okay. <laughs> There's a mechanical benefit to this. So, uh, we've had kind of a different session tonight. Things were a little lopsided. Only two members of the habitual ir irregulars were here. But, Dusty, you are an honorary one. Thank you. Yes, thank you for joining us. <laughs> so, uh, during Geek Out Over the Credits, you get to do, uh, you get to answer one of three questions. How has the crew grown during this session? Which character had the most meaningful interaction with your character? And which of your themes is under the most strain? And if it collapses, what new aspect will show up in its place? Hmm. 
So, uh, Alyssa, how about you start us off? Okay. Um, I think uh, which of my themes is under uh, the most strain. Yeah. Um, I think it's my uh, my personality. My home is where the heart is. Slash, hold your tongue. Um, because I think it was. <laughs> we have a bug problem right now. <laughs> um, my brain just like flew out of. My you mind. you're oh, talking uh, about yeah. Um, Hold your tongue. Yeah, uh, because I think Bryn has not been back to the forge in a little bit, and it is missing home. Um, and she also, I think, is is cracking a little bit, having b being in facing Legion now in this church that she has spent time in before, and in this part of the city that that represents a particular. Uh, crappy part of her childhood. Okay. So go ahead and mark crack on that theme. And Miss Little Leaf? Um, I think, so, uh, the theme that has received the most tension, well, there were, I got attention, um, in sort of tears, but I also received a fade slash crack and Paul's gone. Mm -hmm. And so I feel like if um, if this gets all three and Paul's gone, I think we're going to, that's a huge part of her logos. That kind of keeps that's her That's like grounded. the thing that keeps her grounded. So I think there's going to be some kind of like crazy denial thing happening, which is then going to push Missy to like every, like the idea of like chasing Paul is the thing that anchors literally everything else in her human normal life. Um, so I think it's gonna be like, there's gonna be some kind of, uh, I don't know, like a, maybe some kind of mission where she's, I don't know, like mad at Paul? Re revenge I'm on going Paul? I'm to kill Paul. Yeah, killing Paul. <laughs> Something like that, yeah. Oh yeah. We'll see. All right. And last but not least. Um, <clears throat> I'll say which character had the most meaningful interaction with your character this session. I feel like there were a couple, but I kind of like how she stabbed me and then we essentially electrocuted her. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like that was meaningful, you know, for this uh, relationship yes. to continue. Now I have to ask, <laughs> would Dusty be like angry or like, yeah, we're buddies now. I stab you, you stab me, friends. Yeah, I think it'd be more like that. I think, I mean, I think you have to do a lot to really piss Dusty off in okay. that sense. So in that case, you gain a health point with Missy Little Leaf. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are a little closer as buddies. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because she stabbed me and I electrocuted her. <laughs> That's how you make friends. Yeah. <laughs> That's how friendships are made. Yeah. Violence. <laughs> and hey, have a great night. Thanks Bye. for joining us. Bye.